Masters, masters of the metaverse, masters, masters of the metaverse that travel through time and space and stuff. Troll them, reroll them, throw them above. They fly through dimensions, this isn't the blood. Heroes compelled, they have no choice. The mother winds of a secret voice. Masters, masters of the metaverse, masters, masters of the metaverse. Masters, masters of the metaverse, masters, masters of the metaverse. Hey everybody, it is 6 p.m. Pacific here on Hyper RPG, which means it's time for Masters of the Metaverse, the crazy sci-fi mashup show that we do every week where we've basically <coughs> taken Quantum Leap and Sliders, but not really because that would be copyright infringement, smash them together into this crazy world involving a lot of audience interaction and dice. It's a lot of fun, and we are so glad that you are here to join us tonight. Uh, Mr. Christian Doyle with that wonderful first waffle of the night. A thank you to our very own Alien Knitter, one of the mods who has been helping keep the chaos, uh, not to a minimum, but fairly well organized chaos. Like herding Thank cats. you, AK, yes. for all that you do. So we do appreciate you. A yeah. lot. That's real. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. uh, the show uses a modified form of tristat, which means that uh, rolling lower is better. And in this game, the degree of success on your roll matters a lot to determine yep. how much success you actually have. I believe I have trice. Uh, tri what's it called? Tristat. Tristat for fire insurance. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so you're we're, a good dice with Tristat. It'll be one of those nights, so it's gonna be great. Um, <laughs> the characters in this show are definitely characters. They are each portraying two different identities. A meta pilot who threw a whole bunch of techno babble inserts themselves into an avatar somewhere else in a different reality. They are able then to tap into the abilities and skills of both the pilot identity and the avatar identity, and their power in either is largely based on where they are on these handy dandy sliders that are in front of them. And those sliders are very much controlled by chat, by Slider. you, the computerized hyper-reality amplifier and the transformer, the artificial Slider. intelligence of the metapods, which is very nearly sentient. And chat loves to uh, either to troll the, uh, the team or sometimes just has some little errors and breakdowns. And so things happen like this. Never mind, it was a test. You've passed. <laughs> I failed. But uh, the uh, the things that chat can do, you can um, you can change people's identities. They wind up playing as different characters. You can control how closely they are on their their power spectrum of one identity or the other. Or you can even just mess with the entire show's plotline and force them and me, depending on what you've done, to make up something on the spot through a hack attack. Mm -hmm. So we have a lot of fun things to do with this show. We are very excited. Uh, this show also, we give away some uh, some uh, treats as a thank you to the audience, to you guys in chat uh, every week. Uh, one of the one of the things we regularly do are what we call the Golden Waffle, uh, which is not something to be embarrassed about. A uh, Golden Waffle is a situation where you, um, sorry, my brain. Yeah, no, it's okay. One of those days, we're there. It's Great. Okay, we'll, welcome. We'll welcome. Welcome. We'll fix Did it we break him without saying anything? I think so. I think, does that yeah. count? No, it was a not a self-break. I'm just, the I'm just thinking is like 10 minutes right I now. I just can't help it in my brain right now. I'm still thinking that there's just this little part of Zach that's like, man, we had them in that box on Saturday. They were so safe. They couldn't touch anything else. I believe and Chris just scored the uh, Hyper RPG equivalent of an own goal. Yes, that will. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> it still counts, though. It does. Totally. It does. You get credit for that. I'm so proud. At $500 in the total store uh, <laughs> donations and such for the night, and again at 12.15 we give a golden waffle, which is where we have you provide us with some sort of pop cultural thing you like, a musical genre, and we mash this stuff together and we create some sort of original uh, musical piece just for you yeah. and for everyone else. You know, today I'd really like to hear about uh, a hobby. A hobby. I've been here. I've been doing a lot of okay. songs about different fandoms. I want to know what these people like to do in their spare time, so I can at least write the songs to make fun of them for it. Yeah. So, so instead, instead of like instead giving of... Star Wars, give him watch Star Wars. Yes. There you go. <laughs> That's perfect. Perfect. Yes. Instead of Star Wars, watching Star Wars. So instead of a pop cultural thing today, uh, apparently we will be requesting from you some sort of hobby or interest of yours. Mm -hmm. So we all like get this. to know mm -hmm. each other a little bit better. Yeah. This is gonna get personal. I like it. Yes. Um, the I other to binge the other thing that we do <laughs> is. Uh, the pre-store uh, purchases that some folks have done 
Um, that has allowed each one of these players, everything was already purchased, I looked. Um, it's given them some, some abilities that they otherwise would not have access to, and these abilities are related to characters they played in a different reality. Um, which probably makes no sense if you've never seen the show before. Just right. ask in chat, someone will explain it to you. And I will save us all the time of me trying to do the same thing. Yep. But um, but at uh, it's seven hundred and fifty dollars in the store, and at fifteen hundred dollars, we also do a boosted version of those buffs. So it's a lot of bang for your buck if that's one of the things that you wind up contributing to. And we <laughs> he did the guns do a bang for your buck. For your buck. <laughs> um, I'm just going to ignore it. <laughs> <laughs> it's all good. Tonight's, tonight's the second to last night that I have to GM this show. For, for a, a little while. while so. For a little while. And don't be I should say have to, that I get to. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. Yes, next week. You can tell. You next can... week will be my last night for a little while because Mr. Christian Doyle is going to sit in this seat and I am going to sit in that seat or that seat or some other seat and probably not be able to troll him quite as well. But I do look forward to trying. I, so. I, I look forward to it too. So uh, it should be fun. <laughs> I don't have a lot of GMing experience behind me that isn't in front of hundreds of people. Uh, but luckily, is. we've got chat, so yes, they'll help me. Good. I think you'll do. I think you'll do fantastic. I, uh, yes. No. Go. Okay. Um, so this show, of course, is done in collaboration with Zombie Orpheus Entertainment, <coughs> who many of us have affiliation with and have done uh, films and shows, web series is with. And um, so, the Zombie Orpheus Entertainment Patreon backers Yay! every week are able to bestow on the cast some additional some uh, firepower that they can use. Right. Excuse me, so I'm gonna hand those out right now. How do we use it? Um, Crash Jackson. Yes, sir. Uh, this week, you have negative 100 points of armor. What? Wow. Yeah. What? I didn't even think that was possible. It wasn't until you gave me so much crap at this no. What? I'm kidding, it's just 10 uh, points. Okay, that's, that's fine. So once I start GMing, do you get to write all the waffles? <laughs> I've said I'm willing to do them. I've done some of them. I can't do the guitar like you do. It will almost always be a parody of an existing song to save myself some brain space, but but I can do waffles. So waffles no. are delicious. Yeah. So negative 150 points. No, of... it's you get 10 points of armor. 10 points 10 of points armor. I'll armor. take it. Mr. Johnny Appleseed, Jebediah, you've got 10 points of armor. Uh, Jenica slash uh, Ms. Emily Dickinson, you have 10 points of armor. Thank you, Patreon. Uh, Nick, Teddy, oh. King Ship, your highness. Teddy King Ship. Uh, you have 20 points of armor. Oh, he oh look at you. Go. Uh, I'm gonna go through those so AKA fast. AKA Andy Oakley, you've got 10 points of armor. Yay. And I was skunked this week on armor. <laughs> really? Yeah. They just gave you like a plus 25 I bonus to hit no, somebody? No, I really did not get a lot this week. Oh, it we're was, real uh, broken up about They're that. mad about the cliffhanger. It wasn't a major clip. I didn't do it. It was Matt's fault, but it was never mind. It was awesome. <laughs> um, it was awesome. Uh, Crash, Mr. Richard Gatling, you have a plus three that you can use at some point during the show. All right. Jebediah Johnny Appleseed, you have a plus three that you can use at some point during the show. Uh, Jenica slash Emily Dickinson, you have a plus two that you can use during the show. Okay. Nick slash Teddy, you have a plus four Ooh. that you can use. Rosie, aka Annie Oakley, you have a plus four. And I have a plus four. Mm -hmm. I also yes. forgot to give myself a pencil or a pen I have this pens. week. Or some big boy pens. Uh, you actually had a whole bunch over there, but I was doing the song, and I took all the pencils and pens I saw. Ready? Oh, it's going to be like that. Actually, I don't want to throw uh, too much please stuff. Don't. Okay. We've been teaching the kids not to throw pens at each other, so that's... Uh... Oh, thank you so much. I'm good. I've got <laughs> pencils for days you. now. Thank you. <laughs> for days. I knew it was coming, but I wanted to see Maggie have to run. Um, so... <laughs> Uh, what happened last week? Does anybody remember? Oh, Where? I remember. Nick won the somebody, game. Somebody, yeah. somebody, somebody screwed me over with what they did. Uh, breakdown. Sure, no problem. Uh, we found ourselves at, uh, out of the pods at the beginning of things, kind of trying to decide why we were going back because we were having some trouble uh, getting the mission done because mm -hmm. for some reason, uh, King Teddy's meta pilot Nick did not want to go back to his body. We went back into the pods only to find ourselves like somewhere in the middle of the second American Civil War. Correct. Which was being fought in the American West. Yes. And it was the East versus the West. Yes, we it was the imperialists. Right. Not the imperialists, the industrialists, the industrialists of the East. Mm -hmm. uh, also arguably really imperialist. Yeah, I mean, folks like Morgan and Vanderbilt. And, we rescued uh, Tesla. And the one yeah. who was important to me, Edison. Yes, Edison. Who was an enemy of mine. Correct. Edison, when you when you originally were in the Old West, the 
well, <laughs> this version of the Old West. Yes, uh, Mr. Thomas Edison was after you, was after Richard Gatling. Right. Because you had stolen something of his. Yeah, the prototype gun I made. Yes, I remember. Yeah. Uh, and so then we were in the midst of the, and then we had, uh, we have to go, uh, we had to rescue a guy who ended up Tesla. being Tesla. Correct. Mm -hmm. And we did it by the rest of the party not bothering Emily Dickinson. <laughs> While she went in and did the stuff that she knows how to do, while I distracted you did everybody a very else good job. Yes. Uh, with uh, the the shooting contest they decided to have in the middle of the stealth mission. Yeah, I, I really enjoyed Much actually Richard Gatling babysitting. I, 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 I kind of like that Gatling is the yeah. babysitter of yeah. the group. While Emily went off to actually do the mission, <laughs> and uh, that that worked out pretty well for everyone. Mm -hmm. And uh, then after that. After we got Tesla back, we uh, decided we had to go take the dam because... That was the next thing. That was the right. next thing. That's, that's Right, you learned about this hydroelectric power plant outside of Phoenix. I mm -hmm. believe we decided we were just going to go blow it up. Yeah. yeah. To be fair, that is our modus operandi. All right. Huh. Yeah. Blow it up. So we have to somehow win the Civil War too. Uh-huh. Uh, well, at least electric. you have to... Disable the hydroelectric dam, uh -huh. or at least take it over. And then somehow managed to get Nick to decide to stop being the king of the world. Yeah, and you've got tonight, next week to do it. All right. Okay, let's go. <laughs> oh, and then he owned us. Yeah, we got him drunk. Oh, yeah. Yes. And tried to play some great. dangerous mind games with us. And uh, he did some freaky shit and possessed Johnny Appleseed and, uh, and basically put the mental yeah. smackdown on yeah, everybody yeah. who tried to do anything to yeah. him and it was, was quite amazing. Impressive. I'm not going to lie, that was pretty amazing. It was. In fact, uh, you also <laughs> keep in mind that my character was drunk and had been unconscious for months. <laughs> When I owned you all. Right, okay. Don't rub it in. Okay. I'll take him over and have him rub it in. <laughs> and then I will literally eat his lunch. Okay. I'm not As him. I'm not talking to you anymore. We're not friends. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, Johnny shot me in the foot. No, no, you no, shot you yourself, shot yourself in, the in the foot. I saw it from right over here. Johnny didn't do anything. Jebediah, Jebediah. had you shoot yourself in the foot. That's a fun sentence to make. All right. But she shot me. Autobots. <laughs> so yes, following the end of, uh, at the end of the last episode, as you guys were learning more about this hydroelectric plant uh, out near Phoenix, there really is one out there, by the way, I didn't make that up. It's, it's a nice Easter egg. Is it the, is it the Theodore Roosevelt Dam? It is Theodore Roosevelt Dam yeah. with Lake Theodore what? Roosevelt. What? Yeah, That's a real thing. It's a real thing. He's also got a park named after him in North Dakota. And see, we're it's one of the oldest, uh, It's one of the oldest uh, hydroelectric power plants in the country, like one of the oldest really big ones. Well, clearly this is going to end well for us. <laughs> That's all I can say. Yeah. You're not in that reality, so who knows yeah. what will happen. <laughs> yeah, you have to keep in, in our version of American history, there was no second civil war, right, nor no, was I there know. a zombie apocalypse yeah. at the I'm end of the first one. I'm not that dumb. Everyone knows the zombie <laughs> no, apocalypse cool. didn't happen until World War One. <laughs> so following the end of, uh, of last week, as you guys had made your attempt to uh, get Nick to go back into his pilot form a bit more and try to suss out some more information on his background. Um, you know, you guys spent the night um, kind of recovering from the rescue of Tesla mm -hmm. and such, and uh, and then you made your way back to kind of the base camp that you had been operating out of. When you arrived there, um, everyone was kind of bustling and, <coughs> and such, and there was a message um, for you, actually, that had come in via Gatling graph a, uh, which is now a thing. Yeah. And um, an important message that had been uh, sent into you from via Gatling Graph, um, giving you guys some logistical updates on how the West, how the rest of the Western Alliance has been doing in this war. Um, so what news from the front, sir? Exactly. <laughs> so uh, Franklin, of course, it is his job to come over and give you guys the update on. What's happening? He is, as always, a little bit loath to speak to his older cousin, but I mean, he loves you dearly, sir. He's just, you are you. And, um, and he's getting to that age now where he's not only aware of your, uh, your issues, but mildly embarrassed. <laughs> uh, so he does, yeah, he comes up and says, uh, says to you all, uh, hi, hi everyone, I'm, I'm glad you're back. Speak up, Franklin. Let the people hear your voice. Project, stick out your chest. Enunciate! Thanks, cuz. Hi, everyone. More chest! <clears throat> Hi, everyone. Chest. I'm glad you're back. <laughs> Hi, everyone. I'm glad you're back. Excellent. Yes, there's uh, a, a communication has come in via Gatling Graph. Graph. Gatling Graph. What does it say? Well, we don't know until we use the rotating decoder to find <laughs> out. We've already done that. Oh, good, good. Yeah. I mean, that is. 
Many people have been wondering why you included that in the design, but they've all kind of taken it now as just a piece it of it. It helps make it proprietary. <laughs> yeah, if by proprietary you mean really annoying to use, but... That's exactly what I meant, yes. <laughs> um, so, yeah, so... Um, what I want to say. So, the Cascadians are still uh, fighting very hard up to the north. Salmon and, kissing river riders, excellent. Yes, and uh, they are preparing for an attack um, to free the regions around Pocatillo and Missoula in Idaho and Montana, respectively. Yeah. Well, they had an easy time getting through Eastern Hashtag Washington. Hashtag meta point, it's time for Masters of the Metaverse, where we shall all have waffles at the end. And we will have earned those waffles, which is, as we all know, is for doing good. So let's do it for Zoe. Hashtag waffles, damn it. Waffles, damn it, damn it, waffles. I got I got to see Paxomo's shirt idea for the Renegades, so I know what it looks like now. Yeah, we saw it too. Oh, you did? It's yeah, on like Twitter. It. Uh, oh, it is now? Oh, that's no, cool. maybe it's not. Maybe no, it's it direct messages. Oh, okay, I like the damn it waffles stuff. Yes, I'm yeah. sure you anyway, do. Anyway, I do. I count too. Screw you, Christian. <laughs> With love. You will no, count in two weeks. Ha! And that's a show. No. Um, <laughs> Thanks, folks. So, anywho, uh, the San Franciscan Empire is uh, unable to provide any assistance right now either. Hashtag hack attack. I'm cooking something up in chat. We'll message you once the details are ironed out, Chris. Thanks. Awesome. Thank you. Uh, the San Francisco so Empire is unable to be of assistance right now either, as they are locked in a fierce naval battle out in the Pacific Ocean. Oh. Um, and most of their most of their don't say it. Don't. Wasn't going to. I just realized don't. where that statement was going to go, and don't. so I won't. Don't do it. Don't listen to her. Say it. It's a naval battle. Say you say. It. Tell yeah. me more. It's just you know this. I'm oh. saying. It. Can't say it. Don't. Okay, so we move it. forward. <laughs> There's semen everywhere. I um, knew it! So, um, so the Kingdom of Yosemite is struggling to stay independent the matter, with all of these battles and such that are going on. And um, God, when I wrote the naval thing, I didn't even think about it going there. Um, that was gonna But say. you have, I'm happy to say, you have received some, um, some support from the uh, city-states of uh, Sacramento and wow. Fresno and Stockton. They have been sending oh. uh, it's soldiers. nice to see that they're working together. Mm. They had that three-month-long slap fight with each other. <laughs> Excellent. Glad to see that the farm teams have decided to join the big game. Well, as I recall, <laughs> what, what time of year are we in? Uh, you are still in winter. Winter. Okay, yeah. well, at least it's not that they're fleeing the repugnant summer. No, no. It's actually it's it's livable right now. It's so terrible it's, down there. It's terrible. Um, From what I've heard. Anyway. And the, uh, the loyalties of the Grand uh, Duchy of Los Angeles, though, uh, there are rumors of some swaying there. Um, swaying Archduke there. Caballo Lutero um, is apparently not impressed with how the war is going and is starting to consider. So San Francisco is having problems with navel gazing? Hashtag hack attack. Oh. Nice. That was good. That was excellent. Thank you. Um, and now in character. The, uh, the Archduke, um, there's rumors that he might flip to the industrialists. <gasps> and that if he goes and the rest of Southern California goes with him, um, that, well, not Southern California, the, you know, the Grand Duchy of Los Angeles and the surrounding lands. So we may um, have to assassinate that could an be Archduke. A, that could be a major, major hit got somebody to the Western there. Alliance to lose that region. We could um, you do still have some loyal, loyalists down there who you can mm -hmm. depend on, one of whom is uh, Dona Maria Valdez de Villa. All oh, right, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. we can get her uh, she, to assassinate him. She still has her land holdings down there and has been in contact. She's been one of your primary informants, actually, during the process, or during the war, excuse me. She was um, quite a reliable woman. Yeah, mm -hmm. she's keeping an eye on um, the yeah. Archduke and his his dealings. And difficult such. to get messages to, though, during the day. She's a bit of a night owl. I see well what you played. did there. <laughs> well played. But the, the repercussions of all this intel that you've gathered is that if anyone is going to stop this dam, um, it's it's going to have to be you guys. Well, I think all we right. already decided to go blow it up, so. Indeed, I'm in. Let us go. Is this one of those situations where we damned if we do and damned if we don't? I think it is. It's an excellent turn of phrase, Jonathan. At your command, your majesty. Yes, so, Highness. Something ridiculous. Oh, wait, I said that out loud. <laughs> To the dam! <laughs> so, given your current location, the fastest route to take 
is actually going to head is actually going to send you west towards the San Francisco Bay. Right. Um, via rail, then you'll take another train south towards L.A. Okay. Uh, and then transfer over onto another train um, into the Phoenix area. Oh, mm -hmm. right. That seems very roundabout. No, well, it's... think about the time period in which this is. And if only we had train. Mr. Wilbur Oval Wright's flying contraption. True. No not. one has seen hide nor hair of him for quite a while. Mm. He did not enjoy flying. That's true. <laughs> he yeah. did not. Well, it looks like we can take care of two birds on this journey down. Shall we assassinate uh, that man in L.A.? On the way to Phoenix? Yeah. What if he is not going to flip flop? Well, we could investigate whether he's going to flip or flop. I'm gonna leave that up to the king, seeing as how. I'm not opposed to that. But... No, you're you're an assassin. You wouldn't be. Right. And she tends to shoot anything, whether moving or not. Indeed. Right. Well, very well. Very well. Mm -hmm. I'm saying, Your Majesty, just consider the advice. What and advice? Where it comes what, from. what advice? The advice that they're telling you to kill him when it might not be a great. You know what? Just do what you're gonna do. What is your opinion, Professor? I think we should go into every situation as prepared as possible. Right. So how would you prepare for this situation? By going and completing the mission that we're supposed to complete, which is getting rid of the damn damn. So damn first, and then possible assassination. If assassination is called for, but there's also such thing as diplomacy. Now I said possible. It's like assassination, except more talking and less stabbing. I am also fine with that. That sounds boring. Although you're quite convinced that you could do it if it came down to it. Oh, you could, I you could diplomatize I, like nobody's business. Oh, of course I could. I'd be the one to convince him, clearly. Yeah. I'm the only one in this party who could do that. Yeah, you have the best words. Indeed. The best. The very best. Tremendous words. Mm. And they big words, too, right? Indeed. Are they the biggest? They the are biggest. the biggest words. So should we get on the train and perhaps discuss as we go, or just <sighs> go? Yeah, I'll load up the wagon. So we're leaving the front? Heading to the back. Yeah, the I mean dam. the rest of the rest of Teddy's soldiers are still capable of, you know, carrying Hiding. on with their previous. Uh, oh, and orders. with the king gone, they can use actual military tactics. <laughs> yes, they're actually really excited. <laughs> the, the generals, the general's like, as you guys are having this conversation about leaving, the generals are looking at you all very expectantly. Like, <laughs> you know what I think? Him. You know what I think Please might be a good idea? Him. We should bring Franklin with us. It'd be a good experience for him, I think, don't you? A bully suggestion. Good to see how things done when the when the king. Does thing. Frankie Pants, get in the train. <laughs> Hashtag Rosie, but because she knows best. She does. Thank you. That's true. Uh, so, what, what, what did you say? Thank you, Chad. Uh, Frankie Pants, get in the train. Uh, and Franklin looks around at the rest of the soldiers who all just kind of smirk a bit. And, and I grab him by his trousers and throw him on. <laughs> Mm -hmm. I don't even have to come up with something witty to say. You're just perfect. Thanks. Frankly, <laughs> come here. But I appreciate that. But if she's not good at that... Well, he's airborne now. She just threw wait, him onto the truck. If okay. she's not good at that because it's not actual oh, shooting... Oh, that's true. It's not shooting. There I need might a have roll. been a reason I suggested it. I need a roll. <laughs> Mr. Chris. I forgot about that. Everything you do... <laughs> <laughs> Especially because I'm in the middle, so I'm rolling d 12. So, well. so oh, yeah. is this reality? What would, what would picking him up and throw him onto what, the truck? What's your body? My body a is four. four. I yeah. rolled a six. You, you were remarkably close. So yeah. Uh, Did he hit the door? No, you you. Uh, <laughs> Careful, you'll cripple him. Yeah. <laughs> I was waiting you, for that you one. You did. Uh, you did manage to to pick him up, and um, <laughs> and you were all set to. Um, I'm picturing a WWE stand. move where she's like spinning around. It's like getting them back in the ring. You grab the pants. The, she just, didn't make the roll. I know, but I'm still picturing her. Like the way she's in. Oh, the way she sees it. Yeah, yes. in her mind, this is the baddest ass thing mm -hmm. ever. Um, but no, she, pretty it's, it's pretty simple. Like she picks him up and she starts to throw him, and as soon as she tries to lift him up, it's, you know, his shirt. His pants gives, break. His, yeah, it gives way, and so Where he just falls pants? to the ground. Johnny, I found you a new pair of trousers. He didn't rip his pants off. So let me see. Are we going to dam the dam on the damned river with damning grace? Yeah. Perhaps yeah. Edison will eventually live down this damn shame. Hashtag hack attack. You can say that all you want, but you can't say, you know, Dickinsonian. Mm. Or no. Titan. Or Titan. Or Muffin. Or Muffin. Yeah. I'm sorry, Titan. Yeah. Or Crevice. <laughs> crevice? It's dirty. Oh. <laughs> Depends on the crevice, really. I wonder if they censor moist. 
someone on chat just cringed because they hate that word. I don't know who, but statistically, so. All right, did. so okay, is Franklin, so, all, is Franklin all right? Franklin's fine. He's, Franklin is fine. Uh, he dusts himself off and just looks at you and is about to say something and then re realizes. Franklin, <sighs> he come just here. says, "I hate my life." And then he Franklin, starts, remember, take him aside. Remember, play the cards your Roosevelt. Do not show how you Roosevelt. <laughs> <laughs> you lost he, your pants. Uh, Here's a rose he of belt. He pulls out a couple <laughs> of. Uh, he pulls out a, a, a couple of uh, small uh, spheres and starts rubbing them around in his hand, and they make a tingling noise, and they are stress balls. Mm -hmm. hmm. See, you were wrong. He's got a pair right there. <laughs> then he walks on board the train. I worry about him. So do I. I've got an idea for that, though. Hmm. So you get on the train, you start heading off west, and your uh, your direction uh, out towards San Francisco. Uh, who actually, the emperor there, Emperor Norton, is an old friend and colleague of King Teddy. Here we were. Uh, they've known each other for years, and have, have even uh, spent a little bit of time together in diplomatic uh, conversation and such. How did that go? You can imagine. <laughs> Diplomacy picture, involving Theodore Roosevelt. <laughs> yeah, picture Teddy being a diplomat with, or King Teddy, I'm sorry, being a diplomat with Emperor Teddy. Mm -hmm. That's about how well it went. Okay. Yeah. Oh, so they are very similar in temperament? Oh, that's yes. exciting. But he is an emperor. They're peas in a pod. Okay. Yeah. On a train ride, would you guys like to discuss tactics for blowing up the dam? I mean, clearly I have an idea, and it's the best idea, and it's the idea it's going, it's going to win, it's like we're going to pick it. But I would like to hear your ideas on how you plan to blow up the dam. Well, my plan was to come up with a brilliant plan and then not tell you any part of it so it actually gets done. Well, that just seems idiotic, sir, as I am the one who's going to complete the task. So what was your plan? Blow it up. With? Oh, anything we can find or use. I'm sure I can just shoot at it. You would like to shoot bullets at the concrete. Oh, not the concrete itself. You said it's a hydro... Something hydroelectric, hydroelectric, right? So that there's got to be a w where some place where that starts and ends, correct? So you're gonna shoot the hydro or it's the electric? It's called a river. Well, then we just blow up the river. How do you? That, blow I, I've excellent heard, strategy. I've heard killing a King river. King Roosevelt okay. agrees with me. We will blow up the river. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna shoot the river, which will hopefully kill the dam. I think we have the plan set up. Winking face, send you a message, Chris. I saw where it was going. Thanks. I'll see when it kicks over. Thanks, Chet. If we were to kill the river. That should lead to the death of this hypergeneric dam. Indeed. The hydroelectric. It's a yes. hydroelectric dam. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Gatling does have demolition, by the way. Yeah. I, I can take down a dam. Fantastic. By, we'll find a way to make shooting it work, I suppose. Perhaps there's something you could, that an explosive you could put on just so the she has something. The explosives will have to be planted at various points throughout the dam well, without I'm... anyone noticing. Oh, I can do that. You very. Of course, I'm very stealthy. Then of course there's the impossible shot to yes. hit the detonator, Game which nobody could Avengers. ever make in a million years. I look forward years. to the show every week. Since, Since these seem to always be needed, needed, hashtag MetaPoint. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. So you were saying there's an impossible shot, Professor, that only well, well, nobody could make. Well, in a perfect world, we could pull this plan off, but it would it would require an impossible rifle shot to hit the and, detonator. And what Mr. Gatlin really means is that it's impossible for any normal person no, I, such I, as I'm yourself. I'm sorry, but nobody could ever, ever make that shot. <laughs> I think, I think <laughs> Gatlin... I think I see where you're going, Professor. Not even the greatest marksman in all of the land. Well, I mean, maybe Frank Butler could hit it, but... You bring up my husband one more time and I will smack you so hard in the face you won't I did not here. realize you were married. No, no they, they do, do not, not sense our moist. Moist, 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 moist. This is abuse. Moist, 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 hashtag MetaPoint. And I could tell just a moment ago I was feeling just a little parched. Not anymore. You could dance whole time, that, couldn't you? The whole time that you were speaking to uh, Annie mm -hmm. uh, Gatling, uh, Franklin, after a beat, catches what's happening, and he starts writing some notes down um, and keeps looking at his cousin as if he's learning. <laughs> <laughs> he, po he points at you at one moment and says, Thank you. And just keeps going back to what he's doing. 
<laughs> anyway, th there's no one living that could possibly make that shot, and that's all that really matters. We'll just have to come up with a different plan. How happy I am it is Meta Monday, and I can watch this butterfly of a show. I bunnies that everyone has come prepared for the rainbow's fun that is nine. I hope this isn't kitten by weird sensor or something. Hashtag Jackson Buff. Hashtag Janika Buff. Thank you. Thank you, Jeff. Thank you very much. I have a feeling we're going to need We're going to need them. <coughs> so, uh, see well, you. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Right. I'll be able to shoot the shot. I mean, hit the Won't shot. That, isn't that going to require her to be a long ways away, though? I mean, that's a long way. An impossibly time. long distance away that From nobody dam, yes. could mm -hmm. make. My eyesight is better than anyone on this planet. Uh, we, and also any need a, we also need a lookout. Hmm. While well, the explosives are being pan planted, right? But that's two jobs. How can any one person do both Since of those things, so being both a scout censored, and an expert marksman? There is an incredible amount of freedom to creatively not swear should the mood strike you. In fact, if it's a golf course, you could four swear. Hashtag hack attack examples available upon request. Hashtag thesaurus. Thank you Thank very you. much. Wait, was that our hack attack? Was no. Some, no, some of it. to the hack attack. Okay. Uh, yes, they're just still they're still building towards their hack attack. Okay. I've seen it. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, God. I am afraid. I am afraid. It's frightening. It'll work. It'll totally work. But I do appreciate the plan that we are devising as a group, Professor. But, I mean, there's a dam breaking. There's a good chance I'll be able to do some boating. Indeed. Um, that is another skill that could be used. It could so, happen, is all I'm saying. So and since train, I'm no common sailor, but a master boat mateer, I think that it won't be a problem. So the train uh, continues onward, and yes. eventually, you know, after, uh, after a couple of days, you find yourself um, in the Bay Area. And uh, you, you know, it, it's, it's not the most, it doesn't seem to be the most efficient way to do this, as denizens from a different time and place aware of other forms of locomotion and such, but... Um, you do, you reach the East Bay, and you go down around a bit the South, and you come up uh, into San Francisco. There's a lot of semen scurrying around everywhere. So you, um, you get into the main limits of San Francisco, mm -hmm. and um, Emperor Norton himself is there to greet your train upon its arrival. And uh, upon seeing you all, of course, he does... Well, I shall, of course, yeah. ride in, clutching, hanging from the smokestack. Well, what? <laughs> Hanging from the smokestack. Of course you are. Yes, indeed. Oh, he had a saddle built for the top of the locomotive. <laughs> In, the In the words of one Annie Oakley, I ain't afraid to love a man. I ain't afraid to shoot him either. Hashtag Jebed <laughs> And as, as your train pulls in, uh, you notice a man standing atop another train that is currently <laughs> parked at the station. That must be the end. And, uh, and this man is standing uh, atop it astride, his arms as such, and as he sees you approaching. Teddy! Teddy, my friend, it is so good to see you! Norty! Have you been? Oh! Oh, I I heard word that you were coming. Indeed. Did you get word of my speech that I gave at the Battle of Lake Tahoe? I heard about, not only did I hear about it, but I had my own messengers write it down and disseminate it to the entire empire. Excellent. In the Bully, land I mean. of the moist, only moisties moisten, my moistie hurts. Hashtag towards shack attack. Thank you, chat. Shack attack? It's my understanding that your group here could use some supplies and some light entertainment before you head out on your way. Always for warriors on a secret mission to destroy a dam are we, and we should take in great supplies and entertainment while we can. Hush hush. Now are we changing trains? Oh, oh, I'm sorry, my my dear friend. I don't believe we've met. My name is Emperor Emperor Norton. Em you must say it twice. Emperor Emperor. Only Norton. if you're full naming him. Yes, I do appreciate it. It sounds more regal this way. Your most high regality. Uh, my, I'm Professor Richard Gatling. Yes. Uh, we've been accompanying King Theodore for some time. Yes, my old friend. <laughs> so will we be changing trains, does anyone know? Pyro Popon Pawn, Pyro Popon Pawn, hashtag hack attack. Thank you. I don't know what Thank you very much. Uh, he, he looks confused for a moment. Oh, I, Teddy, did you? Teddy. 
Don't tell me you forgot. He won't tell you that. Let's, pre <laughs> let's pretend, for the sake of argument, that I have. <laughs> well, well, Teddy and I go back a long time, and as I'm sure you can tell, we've, we've time or two tried to best each other in games of skill and ability. What are you hinting at, Nortanian? Tell me more. Well, I do believe you have forgotten the last wager that we waged. Mm. Wait, just to, be before you do that, I, um, as Jenica, I want to kind of like <coughs> suss out where Nick is, or where Teddy is in his recollection of this past event. The Emperor Emperor seems slightly odd, but, but never, never mind, mind. mind. Things, Things can, can still be fine, fine. fine. If, if we, we all stay, stay cool, 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 hashtag cool rule. Ah, yes. thank, you, thank you, Chat Chat. Thank you, thank you, Chat Chat. Uh, yeah, I, go ahead and give me, uh, uh, I guess it'd be a psychology roll. Yes, I'd like just to do a psychiatry roll. That's mm -hmm. good. Yeah, no. Oh, yeah, no. No. Okay. Well, I saw you failed to psychoanalyze no, the man in the bear suit? <laughs> yes. yes. Couldn't have been easy. Pretty, pretty definitively with those twelves, actually. Hanging from a train. <laughs> well, I think it was one or two years before the war started that mm. Teddy and I last spent time together. And remember, we were fishing out on the bay. Yes, fishing off the dock of the bay. This is the first time I've been able to catch the show live. So, so here's, here's to make up for the tips I've wanted to give in the past and couldn't. Oh, thank you. Hashtag hack attack. Oh. Thank you very much. Oh, thank you. Wait, that's not good, is it? No. Sometimes, Sometimes it's, good. it's good. Sometimes good. they kill a town. <clears throat> yeah. No, chat gets moody. Well, to make a long story <laughs> short, we engage in a bit of, uh, you know, one-upmanship, as it were, to see who could catch the most and the largest fish. I can't imagine. Where is this all leading? Well, there was a wager in play. Was there? Yes. Um, do believe there was? Yes. And uh, while I don't like to speak ill of my good friend, he was not able to complete it before having to return back to his kingly duties. Now, in my favor, I, I am a great conservationist, and I did not, of course, wish to deplete the fishing stock of my good friend Emperor Emperor Norton's Bay too severely, you understand. Which I, I appreciate. But, but I... But as such, he still does owe my citizens at least one night of entertainment. Well, he is to provide the entertainment. What type of entertainment were you expecting? What other kind is there? Tell them, Norty. Oh, well, we actually, uh, when I heard word that he was coming with such a fine group of soldiers and uh, performers and such, I thought it would be an excellent opportunity for a, a moment of gladiatorial so showmanship. Bully. Oh, but at the same in. time, I, I recognize that there were some among you for whom this may not be the most appropriate way to show your true abilities. And so we've also devised a, a very simple obstacle course for some of your number to compete on at the same time. What Should if you want to do both? At the same time. It would be difficult. If I can do mm. one into the next one. Or I could just run the obstacle. We'll, we'll work it out. Yes. Uh, okay. Is there a... So this is something we all are taking part in. Oh, absolutely. Indeed. That is my moral imperative as your king to fulfill my wager, and yours as my attendance to participate. Attendance? Uh, I... All right. That oh. sounds super to me. Do we I'm, have... I'm sorry. Are you nervous? I, I don't know what we're... No. Shall I remind you of the sound of a chicken? Just caught off guard. No, you, you reminded Missed, me yesterday okay. four times. It is the bird associated with cowardice. Yes, I, I'm aware. It makes a sound like, caw, 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 caw. <laughs> I learned that from him. Emperor Emperor Norton is really very good at impressions. Mm. <laughs> um, I would, uh, Hashtag hashtag a vision comes to King Teddy of a being even greater than himself and he is. Compelled to constantly praise and try to convince the others of the greatness of the majestic OD. <laughs> so that was a real, I gotta translate this one, but this is a real hack attack that's gonna come up at some point. Uh, a vision comes to King Teddy, and he is compelled 
to sing praises to the majestic Odie. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, that's what I heard. I, I'm liking this hack attack. That's uh, a being even greater than himself, and he is so compelled wait, wait, to consistently pray to try to convince the others of the greatness. Because they wanted yeah. Chris to win. No problem. Because we'll, they we'll, want... We'll, 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 yeah, yeah. Okay, we'll, all right. We'll, we'll, we'll work this in in just a moment. No I see your game. I see what they're doing. I see, yeah, I see. I'm I think better. it's funny that they think I just won't kill him off in two weeks. Okay. So I am to sing the praises. Don't be too nice to him. <laughs> of one OD. The greater, the greater being. Of yes. than you. Yeah. And try to convince everyone else of His Majesty as well. Yeah. Yes. <sighs> okay. Uh-huh. So uh, in the this. middle of your conversation, I can give you a setup for it. Ish. I need none. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> me to know and. The great and giving OD who pr- <laughs> produces for us so many scenarios that we may knock them down. Praise be. Praise be. Praise I forgot about your recent conversion experience, mm-hmm. Your Highness. It's uh, it's gonna be a long night. <laughs> um, <laughs> the um, I have but yeah, the uh, the Emperor's uh, retainers come and help you with some of your supplies and such, and uh, yeah, the the basics of the situation as it has been presented to you is is pretty straightforward. Uh, due to a prior agreement between the Emperor and King Teddy, um, there was an ag- there was a um. The king was supposed to be uh, to help with the entertainment of the people on one of his last trips. He'd agreed right. to this, not uh, out of any sort of compulsion, but just because of his own general sense of generosity and such. And um, and that was not able to be fulfilled. And so, um, as a result, um, he the expectation is that your your fine party will will take care of this. So well, the Roosevelt always pays his debts. Are this we is true. are we given? Time to prepare. Do we have a plan, or are we just going right in? We uh, need b- none. Trust in the magnificent Odie to see us through. May his golf shorts never fade. <laughs> I hate this time of year. Well, Walter. Mm-hmm. Okay, now I like well this attack. Um, Raise his name. He of the golden socks and silver Birkenstocks. <laughs> I am not wearing Birkenstocks. socks and Birkenstocks. <laughs> I like that they both The exquisitely got quaffed one, who uses more hair product than deodorant. I use like a little dick. <laughs> praise be his name. All praise him. That is a royal edict. Praise, praise, praise be his name. Praise be to Odie, who can recite all Friends episodes by name. <laughs> or at least his wife could. <laughs> there was that one where Praise that he who owns every Weird Al album. <laughs> Only up until the early 90s. <laughs> praise he whose lucky charms we shall not pretend to steal. So, uh, yeah, the situation you find yourself in is that there is simultaneously, there are two forms of entertainment being offered to the masses. That, Besides uh, the one for us. <laughs> <laughs> there are three forms of entertainment being offered to the masses. Um, Praise he who is unshakable under pressure. <laughs> and uh, one of them will involve two members of your team in a gladiatorial um, situation. Now, when you say gladiatorial, do you mean actually using using a gladius? No firearms are allowed, but uh, melee weapons of all types will be provided and available. Obstacle course is the one for me. It is written that to kill the GM is to become the GM. This ship must have a captain, whether or not he has boating, or secretly is trying to take over DFA with a heinous plot so terrible I dare not even speak it aloud. Or it's a hashtag hack attack. I actually don't know which one they were talking about. I, uh, I've been tracking stuff. Okay. Uh, well, okay, so there's two people gladiatorializing. Yes, and then uh, the rest of you... That's, the other that's th- when two gladiators talk about current events. <laughs> gladiatorializing. <laughs> Praise be, Odie. <laughs> and the other three of you are going to do an obstacle course. Uh, do we know who is the scientist? Do we have time? What do you need? If you guys can just decide how you're going to handle it. Oh. Uh, Mr. Gatling... What would you like to do? Well, I heard there's no shooting involved. Indeed. I'm going to run the obstacle course with my fine agility. Yes, each of you will be required to complete the obstacle course. Uh, Miss Dickinson? I could do either, I suppose. I suggest you uh, help help on the obstacle course. I could do that. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Make sure the team all gets across the finish line. I could do that. Mm-hmm. I think you are implying that I will not make it across the finish line, and I'm insulted by that. I wasn't talking about you. I'm pretty sure. We oh, protect. absolutely. Thank you so much, we Mr. Gavin. Mm-hmm. I am on board else. with the play. Mm-hmm. Jonathan. Oh. 
<laughs> By Holy Odie's drawer full of shell necklaces, I shall enter the arena. Who's gonna fight him? <laughs> I'll go with you. Excellent. I think that is a good choice, as depending on what weapon you are given, Odie though shall it's not a firearm, I'm sure you can come up with some way to make it shoot forth. The great Odie shall see us through, for he is farsighted. <laughs> and Pro nearsighted. Progressively. Johnny. By vocally. Who's yes, yes. You can call my name. doing which? Uh, uh, Johnny Obstacle. and Emily and I will be doing the obstacle course, for which I would just like to point out, Mr. Johnny, that uh, you should find out if pants are optional or required. Oh. I know. Uh, our pants that we optional? Say is no. the gladiatorial portion, no. is it group combat or is it one on one on one on one? Two on two. Two on two. That's my favorite kind of combat, but. Yeah. Yes, I'm running the Yes, pants obstacle. are required, Jonathan. Not... I, I heard from the rules. Pants are required. Praise the OD hashtag hack attack. Praise OD. Praise the OD, Praise. whose anagram name is, is Chode. <laughs> That's true. No, there's an R in there. Ah. Uh, Choder. Oh, that's right. Choder. Is Choder then? Ha! <laughs> is Choder. <laughs> I like that the hack attack included him having to convince us to praise you, and we were just like instantly on board. <laughs> yeah, you're on board. Choder is such a good word because it took us like five years to really admit. Here's know that it meant showed the door. Yeah. Here's the question. <laughs> I have not laughed so hard <laughs> I would since like, I watched Holy Holy Try. <laughs> I would just like to say some sexy Emily, Emily rainbows, rainbows. Poetry would, would be wonderful, wonderful right now. I got some. Can, Can you, you recite it from memory, memory Miss Emily? Emily? No. Hashtag no. hack attack. Uh, I have not laughed so hard since I watched you Holy Holy You best start memorizing. Uh, can I have a minute to memorize it? In it's which case I could. Yet. She will find the shortest poem in the book. <laughs> Does it have to be sexy and short? Look, that one's the four lines. I know, but it's not sexy. Roses are red. Shh. Oh, I could, I mean, does it have to be an Emily poem? <laughs> Emily is hot. It was not, they did not say Emily Dickinson poetry. I'm assuming they meant it. Well, they okay. need to be clear in their well, intentions. Well, while we're waiting, we can maybe sing a, another poem. hymn to his greatness. No, no, I, I have a Oli. poem. I have a poem. Roses are red, violets are blue. The show is too long tonight. No. <laughs> Praise oh, be to Holy Odie, who needs not to rhyme in a simple couplet. <laughs> Beyond form is he. <laughs> Clock it. Time. Hold it. Excuse me. Oh. Excuse me. Winner! <laughs> okay, game's on. So, uh, yeah, so you guys are in a situation now where, yes, you have been divided into two groups that we need Indeed. to take uh, care of in this scenario of such and whatever the hell else. Um, I, I'm using a meta point. So you enter, you are brought to a uh, large arena in the center of the city. Um, it has been outfitted with um, a, in, no, in near the center. Fine, what is it? What are you gonna say? No, I just wanna know what, is it, is it, are we, what city? You're in San Francisco. We are, so there is a giant arena in the middle of San Francisco. That's all I wanted to know. Well, yes. it used to be called Candlestick Park, but now they have electric lights. You're welcome. I'm, I'm trying really hard to figure out what setup I'm accidentally. No, no, I, really, I was so really just asking. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, no, it would be the Cow Palace. Uh, sto story question, that was yeah. no. I'm not setting you up for a horrible fall, palace. I promise. Real thing. Cow Palace. Yeah, yeah. it's a, mm -hmm. an arena. It's a real thing. I don't think um, it was built. So the arena is no. laid out with um, a, an obstacle course basically going around uh, much of the perimeter, mm -hmm. while in the center is this gladiatorial uh, combat area. Um, the, the residents, the citizens of the Empire of San Francisco. You just, you just I'm just, I, I'm trying so hard to think through every sentence that I say and figure out what I'm going to say that's going to be taken in the wrong direction. So really, you Holy Odie's words cannot be taken the wrong direction. Praise he whose shirt has come unbuttoned. <laughs> Made you look. <laughs> <laughs> behind Garfield and keeps his eternal company. He who would protect his world through secret betrayal. He who grants us the great waffles. Damn it, waffles. Hashtag hack attack. Thank you, Chad. 
Yeah, so the, the, yes, the, the citizens of the Empire of San Francisco enjoy their entertainment uh, to come in multiple forms at once, and so they have the, uh, the opposite course around the perimeter and gotcha. the gladiatorial uh, arena in the center, and uh, so you are all brought to your starting locations. The, the gladiatorial section is basically just a giant ring um, with uh, about what, uh, wet waist to chest high uh, barricades and such to hide behind. Hashtag Hackadag nice. praise be to OD who shall liberate a bottle stolen from the mad grip of the evil get ill man and drink heavily from the rainbows of life tonight. As it has been written, so it shall be, as it will be, so it will be written for the will of OD. Thank you, so say we all. So, uh, so say we all. So and uh, the... Thank you, Chat. Um, yeah, so you guys are brought to your respective starting positions. Uh, Gatling and Teddy, you find yourself in this center ring, mm -hmm. and uh, with this cheering crowd um, around, the people are just going crazy. They're so excited. They've been they've been hyped and pumped for this event for uh, for days, actually. Are because, we the first ones up? Yeah, well, the, you guys are the entire event that they're all here for. Oh right. my God! Yes. Are you ready, Doctor Gatling? No, I am not. Praise I... be to he hold halls the many boxes of discs in his dwelling. <laughs> Praise be to he who is a disc hero, and that is another anagram. Hashtag hack attack. <laughs> Thank you. Do not be uh, worried, Professor Gatling. Holy Odie shall see us through. Who has proven many things to us, such as a man can wear pastels. <laughs> Ah, I do miss the springtime, your majesty. For some, it never ends. It's just that I am so afraid of mortal one-on-one -on -one or two-on-two -two combat of any time, but I will put my faith in his name, his name that wrote the hymn of true love called I Have a Full-Time Job. I, I propose before we start the combat that you maybe eat an apple of Johnny's. Yes, please, if you don't mind. But then wouldn't I? Just one for the bag. <laughs> <laughs> Have an and the other three of you are brought over to the starting uh, position on this obstacle course, um, where your goal is to to complete it. Uh, all but three of you. I'm, I took a meta point, by okay. the way. And I'm, I'm going to do some very intense stretching before this obstacle course to okay. prove my athletic ability, which I assume stretching. I have to roll for. I'm just going to move one one over I, here closer to Johnny. Me too. as well, please. Thank you. Okay. So that's three total points we spend in that. Thank you, chat. Take one more off, Chris. I, it was two, well, one each. And then he took yeah, one. Oh, okay. What? Uh, how many are left? Uh, two. You have one left. One. One left. Is that all right? You had to use it quick. Yeah. It wasn't, I, we didn't have turns yet. I thought we could only do this on our turn. Shit! We're prepping for something. Take it! Take it! Take it! Won't do me any good. Oh, I could. I would need both. I'll, uh, I'll you wait. You have a buff you could use. Yeah, I know. Okay. I, I may I have to do that. Buff. I could um, do mine too. I'm you already did it. Okay. It's done. Okay. Thanks. So Maybe the power of the OD will grant us more meta points. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, your attention please. Welcome to the Empire of San Francisco's luxurious cow palace. Yeah! Your entertainment tonight. Flush with bravado and attitude from the kingdom of Yosemite, the one, the only King Teddy himself, King Theodore. Roosevelt! Crowd goes crazy. All praise be the smooth skinned one. And hanging out with King Teddy is a, a new a new fan favorite. We're sure he'll become Professor Richard Machine Gun Gatling. I don't really appreciate the name. Oh, here. Hey, thank you. Hashtag Wave to the people. Point here you are Christian. Have fun. Aw, <laughs> thank, thank you. you. Thank you, chat. Oh, they gave us a bunch. They did. They gave it down. Yeah. Thank you. I'm having fun. Do you still need two meta points, though? Uh, just... I will. Uh, I will use them um, to wait till we start things. Okay. I don't know. How, I, it depends on how this is looked. Cool. I will use two uh, meta points if that's all right. Go. How many? Go. Let's just. <laughs> Let's just. All right. Do they're doing it. They're doing okay, it. Now, okay. Meta points are all been sudden... dropped. Uh, I'm full Teddy. I'm, okay. Consider them spent. Okay. I'm just they are spent. Waiting to move. So they're not spent. Uh, I was going to wait for the combat to start, so don't spend them yet. I'm so confused. There's an introduction happening. I didn't want to interrupt you. Oh, uh, gotcha. And simultaneously, if you look over at the obstacle course competing for your enjoyment tonight. Poetry fail. Miss Emily must take a hashtag meta point in the wrong direction. <laughs> I memorized one. 
I have Wait, it ready. Wait, they can make us do that? Uh, we've never had that as a thing before, but now I'm tempted to make that a thing for next week. Just have, so where do I have to be? Right or, or should I recite the poem so they don't get mad? <clears throat> well, if you wanted to recite a poem, but you can do that later now. I don't, what do I do? Do I listen, do I do this, or do I you make, do say you. a poem? You do you, I was gonna do an intro. You so. heed the word of Holy Odie. What does Holy Odie wish I'd do? Um, I'm gonna complete my intro at some point, so you have to decide <laughs> in about five seconds, or I'm just gonna talk I've got you. an arrow here, loving the hand that sent it, I the dart revere. That was a poem. Excellent. It was hers. There you go. I'm staying. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> I can't mess with that. The gentlemen are saying. laughing at us, specifically Dickinson. Uh, and the your attention over to the obstacle course tonight, competing for the very first time, the geriatric known as Johnny <laughs> Appleseed. That's right. He's like 110. Crowd, <laughs> crowd goes crazy. People are a little confused as to why Cash he's in the position. for life as if we have not set this off the rails enough. Let's, Let's build, build towards, towards some dancing. dancing. Oh, that's For the great OD will help us whether they be male or female. Also, too bad Texas is so busy with that weird wall. I know. I appreciated that weird wall. I had someone actually sent me, oh, it was a dad one? Uh, there was a really cool fan fiction that got sent to me last week about the uh, Texas wall and everything else. I'm not hmm. sure if it ever got posted in Discord. It was I'm not sure I ever heard of it. I, never saw I, will, it. I will pass that along to you guys. Okay. Um, I'm sorry, I didn't think to check it right now. Um, but since I've already broken, really enjoying the fan fiction and the, uh -huh. the drawings and paintings and stuff. You yep. guys are amazing. Awesome. Um, yes, the geriatric Johnny Appleseed crowd goes crazy. Bah! Hanging out with Johnny tonight is the poet extraordinaire, Emily Dickinson. <laughs> and the, uh, in, in the in the three spot for the obstacle course, a woman whose reputation knows no end. Annie, get your gun, Oakley! And I shoot his microphone right after he says that. <laughs> Take a shot. Uh, and he's dead. That is an 11, so I beat it by five. <laughs> shot goes off and mic, well, he doesn't have a mic. I mean, we're- uh, Well, I assume he's projecting his voice through something. Probably a megaphone yeah. or he's just yelling really loud. Yelling through a megaphone. Okay, Greg, shoot the megaphone. You fire a hole straight into it? Yeah. Um, I'm just showing off. Okay. Uh, he, like, he looks over at you and... It's like the this episode is... of The Simpsons where Homer buys a gun and he's just like turning the lights off with it. Exactly. In some ways, uh, this America is the same as the real America. As soon as, as soon as you shot it in the same fluid motion, he drops it, picks up a spare. Then exactly. He, he continues on. Um, remember, uh, for uh, the, the rules tonight, there are none. I don't know, he said something. I got so distracted by all the stuff that was happening and I just want to throw shit at you now. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, but <laughs> the, you say rules, there are no guns allowed. Yes, no firearms in the uh, gladiatorial combat. However, firearms are okay in the obstacle course because there is some target shooting you will have to do. Okay. <clears throat> so, uh, so why don't you give me an initiative roll? Oh. Oh, and, and during the introductions for this, your, uh, your two opponents okay. have not revealed themselves yet. Mm. I am uh, more than a little nervous. I am more the than a little nervous. The cow palace is filled to capacity, and the crowds do cheer for those who come to entertain us. Are you not entertained? Raise your voices loud in the cow palace so that it may be instead known forever as a cattle. Rattle. Hashtag meta point. Hashtag praise a theater. Thank you very much, Thank Chad. Thank you. Thank you, Chad. Um, I got a uh, 17. Okay. Are you kidding me? No. 16. Holy flarking schnit. Okay. I got, yeah, I rolled two twos. Yeah, I rolled a seven and a four. And what then you I got? have a bonus. 30. 27. What? Yeah. I know. Well, <laughs> I, I hate to ruin terrible. your day. You already um, did that by but, coming here. <gasps> 17. 17. You still won that <laughs> I can't believe that. It's your lucky day, Mr. Oh. Gatlin. I'm impressed by how Gatling was a 27 inspired or 30. you are. 27. 27. Oh, the 27. Miss Teddy, Teddy was a 30. I have the 30. Oh, wait, right. no, I spend them right before. Because I already spent the points, so. Yes. Okay. Oh, that's why. I what I meant to say was 36. Because mm. he went over to a. Oh, crash that's what side. you want to do. Okay. All right. Well played. Well played. 
person I still assume is Richard Gatlin. <laughs> Uh, Teddy Roosevelt, do you notice something different about Mr. Gatling? We are not anywhere near Teddy. I mean, you, you can still communicate for yourself. Oh, that's right. I feel like you guys deserve this hashtag system shock. Oh. Is that, Thank you, Chad. Was that, was that mean? There is a great many things it we is. do deserve. It is. And, uh, I'm content to drop that one now. Of course you are. Um, we finally got everything we wanted. Oh, no. <laughs> Only to have it taken from Shoot, us. that's a random it's one. Like so, every other um, television show. Rosie, uh, all the way pilot. Oh, God. Shit. Uh, you're exactly where you are. Oh. All the way pilot. Well, shit. You have no legs! All the way pilot. By Odie's legs. grand tube socks. Oh. <laughs> I'm not wearing tube socks. <laughs> one point towards Avatar. Ugh. Son of a bitch. There you go. Oh, crap, he's on there. And uh -huh. at that moment, um, there was a huge uh, burst of energy and volume from the crowd as uh, dropping from the ceiling are a couple of cages. And they land in the center of the gladiatorial arena. And they open up and out walk just a couple of, of just, you know, very... Uh, just very large trusted uh, tough looking dudes, you know? All right. That they keep in cages. Mm -hmm. And they just start pounding their chest. And, and one of them grabs some dirt on the ground and flings it up. And Aren't they? So they, they point out at you guys and, and they say, no. And they don't even say anything. He just looks at you. Are they hairy? Points. <laughs> Is he looking right at them? Yeah, he is. And then there is a, uh, a loud, uh, there is a sound of a gunshot from offside, which you have been told is the cue to begin. I shoot the bullet. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm all the way, I can't. You weren't expecting I it. I can't, I'm no. all the way, no. I'm, I'm all the way rosy, I can't. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Screw you, system shock. I could've shot that bullet. Yeah. Uh, so yes, you. Chris wins. Chris wins. <sighs> for the once, <laughs> one time tonight. Um, yeah. So, so that's how it begins. You've got these two guys now who are staring down the two of you, and are clearly your two opponents. And, uh, and they're just big guys. Just a couple of big guys. That's it. Are we rule of cooling as well? Are they Eventually. armed? Okay. Gatling, you're up first. Nope. Hold. Okay. I would like to say. I mean, they're all the way across the arena, right? Uh, they've landed probably about mm, oh, 30 feet from you. But they're unarmed and just beating their chests. Yes. And they threw dirt in there, too. Don't forget about yeah, that. Yeah, I remember the dirt flying in the air. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, no, I I kind of hold stock, stock still okay. and hold my action, just getting ready for, you know, waiting to see what happens next. Sounds good. Preparing uh, myself for a lunging attack. I get it. Uh... King Teddy. Can I make a mind roll or something to tell where he is on the slider? Sure, why not? Yeah, beat it by three. Okay, yeah, you know that he is very much pilot at the moment. All right. Jackson. I, I probably prefer Crash. Crash. Yeah. Listen to me very carefully. I am. We're going to take out the one on the left first. Okay. Right? Yeah. None of this one-on-one -on -one stuff. You get him high, I'll take him low. This conversation didn't happen. Deal. Gold. Cool. For when they attack. Got it. Uh, that's going to be the next action, is that they are going to start charging at you two. All right. And they both let out just a bell of, and come running at you. Nice. I believe you're first. Unless yeah. we go off at the same time. You interrupt yeah, I mean, same, I, you, you had kind uh, of a, a ready action you said, that you yeah, want to use. I say, I say we go for the combined attack on the one on the left. Let's do it. Okay. Big go stick on the guy on the left. Taking, Going for the legs, and Sounds I'm going to... Sounds good. Gonna... Okay. Oh, shit. Beat it by 12. Oh. <laughs> Roll the one and the two. That's a good hit. That's a nice... That's All right. Big uh, stick. Yeah, so he, he'll come in real low with the big stick, catch, catch yep. him behind the knees, just as he does. 
Just as he kneels down from the attack, I'm gonna like step up on his knee like a stair and then just jump knee him in the face with my other leg. Okay, uh, give me a roll for it. Yes. 72, nine, so I beat it by seven. That was quite a coordinated attack, gentlemen. Uh, so I have uh, I have good news and bad news. That's fine. Um, um, the good news is he did make the defense on the first attack. He missed it on the second. So you were doing what, uh, Crash? I'm just I was just you know kind of knee striking him in the face. Okay. Uh, kickbox style. And this was Crash doing the attack, basically, right? Yeah. So. Okay. So thirty points of damage. Uh, thirty six. But yeah. ACV plus. 20 damage. Oh, I'd assumed you included that in the other statistics. No. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. So that is that. Um, you felt like he got a good solid kick on him. He did just definitely move out of your big stick, but you didn't feel like you hit him quite as hard as you had wanted to. Um, the other one will still come towards you guys. Odds evens. And, uh... He'll take a lunging tackle at Gatling. Uh, he would hit. Uh, may I use one of those tens real quick? Mm -hmm. Thanks. You have to grab my doubles. Oh, uh, missed it. He got me. He got me. Okay. Uh, in that case. Bad roll. In that case, he's just gonna come up. Mm -hmm. Hashtag meta point back was. Totally awesome. Mac, please never leave us. <laughs> Aww. Uh, the other, so the other one, uh, as you were attacking the first guy, the one on the right comes up, grabs a hold of you, and just throws you towards the nearest barricade. Oh. Okay. I. Uh... Um, and you said you made that you didn't. I missed, my, I missed my defense by one, but I've got cat-like and balance, so I should be able to land on my feet. Okay. Cool. Um, so you will take uh, 35 points of damage. Minus you... my armor for the day, minus Correct. my actual body armor, and I'm still okay. Cool. Sounds good. Um, and then the other one, uh, since he's now with mm -hmm. you, Teddy, uh, will take a swing. And he will miss on his first attack. And he will hit on his second attack. I will... Should I use my bonus? Nah. Uh, I missed the defense. Okay. Um, so he does basically the same thing. He just picks you up and throws you at the next nearest barricade. Mm -hmm. um, and he does uh, 20 points of damage. There goes my armor. Meanwhile, you all up on the uh, on the beginnings of the obstacle course. And we can see them, right? Yep, you can see everything that's going on. So I'm going to um, relate to my friends that uh, that the, ah, President Teddy is very, um, or King Teddy, I'm sorry, is very um, strangely mellow and has tactical planning and I'm noticing <laughs> some of the things that he is doing and saying, so. It does seem weird. Yeah, per perhaps, hopefully, um, Crash can <laughs> relate to him in some way. All right, um, whose turn is it? <laughs> so first up on the uh, obstacle course is either Emily or Johnny, and the first thing before you is really simple. It is a target that needs to be shot. I have um, throwing stars, Jonathan. Would you like me to? And I also have a you derringer. Have One of you needs to do it. I have a derringer. You're, you're good at throwing things. You, you go ahead and do that. I'll can look. I throw it with a throwing star? You can throw your throwing star, yeah. Okay. I just didn't know if it would count. Yeah, give me the roll. Okay. I'm gonna use my Patreon buff so that okay. I can beat it by one. Okay, cool. So you fire it off and hit this uh, first target. That's all you need to do. As soon as you hit it, it just makes a ting bing sound, and you guys are cool then to progress forward. The next thing in front of you is a barricade. Uh, it's a bunch of stacked uh, platforms mm -hmm. um, that you just need to climb on top of and just kind of work your way up. Okay. Do we roll for that or? Uh, well, you just did yours. I just you did could my do thing. A, You could do a move to go do that, and then the other two on their turns can try and get up there as well. Okay, I move to do that. Mm -hmm. So give me a roll for acrobatics oh. or something. Okay, I have acrobatics. I also have climbing walls. That would work. I beat 
Either one of those by six. Cool. You are you clamber yourself up on the platform or look behind you. You can start helping the others if you want. Uh, Johnny, you're up next. You just need to climb up this uh, platform. All right. Um, I'm still going to grumble and be like, son of a bitch, stupid. Why? Why? That's what I want to know. Why? As I'm taking her hand and climbing up the stupid wall. Are you taking Rosie's hand? Four. No, her hand. I'm already up. She's already up on the wall. Okay. Uh, beat it before. Cool, and you'll get a bonus also for her helping you out. So now you are up on top of the arcade as well. Annie, or I guess I should call you uh, Rosie now. Rosie, uh, being slightly knowledgeable in herself, mm -hmm. sees that the first one was a target mm -hmm. and uh, is using her buff to move herself. Sounds good. Over here. Uh, and uh, Rosie will also climb the wall. Oh, oh, no. Can she use sports for that? Mm, what do you want me to use? Well, if you I'd do, you have to use 2d12 plus 2. No, I mean, I can still roll under. Oh, oh no, right, right. But it's a skill. Well, what am I using? Well, if you're using sports as Annie. Right, it's 2d12 you... plus 2, but what would you have me roll otherwise? Climbing? Just, just, I, well, I just don't. a body check right now. Yeah, because you don't have any other skills with her. But I you can get a plus 2 bonus yeah. from each one of them. Oh, yeah, definitely giving her a hand. Uh, all right, well, then we'll do sports, which is nine. Plus two. Plus two is 11. Right on. I'm right on it. Sweet. Uh, so you are able to get down. And honestly, without your guys' help, Annie was not going to get up there. Mm -hmm. She thinks that she helped you back yeah. up there or something. Oh, right. Yeah. Um, but yeah, she grabs your two hands. You guys heft her up. Now you've all made it on top of the first little thing. And, uh, and you see before you, um, as you climb on top of it, you look ahead, and next you see a... Um, uh, it's just a, a balance beam, basically, that you're going to need to cross. All right. And on that balance beam, there are some uh, people on either side who are throwing heavy uh, punching bags. Ah, this is goddamn American Gladiator. Uh-huh. Right. Gladiatorial combat. Gladiatorial combat. American Gladiatorial combat. Mm-hmm. Okay, so I have my special movement. I have balance slash cat-like. Oh, do we have to let them go before right. we do uh, I'm just letting you know what was next, because, yes, oh, now yeah, we're back okay. over here. So we're at the top. So Gary, you're up next. Whoa. Uh, let's see. Where are we on boosts? You have each unlocked your boosted power, by the way. Oh. That happened just a little bit ago. That's All right. Good question. Thank okay. You, Chad. Okay. I might need that for something other than gladiatorial combat. So just to be safe. Um, and nothing else drops this turn. No hack attack. No rule of cool. Uh, no, not yet. Groovy, groovy. All right, then. I am. Uh, well, one of the hack attacks already dropped because it was the OD one. Right. And is, was the other one where I had to do a pro on one of them? One of the hack attacks is, um, no, that was something else. Oh. Um, one of the hack attacks, oh, did, AK, can you send me a message if that one everyone was planning happened or not? I got lost in all the conversation. From... Um, and then also if you could send me a message because there was that hack attack we started the day with that I never heard the final vote on, or verdict on what was going on there. Um, so yeah, no, nothing else is happening yet. You just, you've got a couple of big guys who are trying to beat the tar out of you. All right. I love big guys beating the tar out of me. <laughs> no, wait. I don't like it at all. Okay. So big guys, I'm going to, I'm gonna, again, I'm going to climb up to the top of this big guy. Because, mm -hmm. you know, I'm not a big guy and climbing up to the top where the head is seems like the best idea. Right. But, uh. And if we've learned anything from this channel, it's that when faced with a larger opponent, what you should do is try to scale, you know, scale them as much as possible. Like, right. And then beat them with a wrench. Well, I'm, I'm already like, I'm just on the barricade. I'm just gonna like wrap myself yeah. and try a, try a grapple attempt. Cool. This round is to grapple. Um, I'd like to use something out of Gatling's bag. Okay. He has uh, some duct tape kind of stuff, rubber duct tape. Yes, you did mention that once before, yeah. That he used uh, to bat patch a hole, and I'm gonna use that to wrap around the face of the big fellow. Cool. I need some sort of acrobatics or body type check or something yeah. for the uh, for what you're trying wrap to do. Wrap around the face. Or I'll even let you try an unarmed if you want to do it that way instead. I would like to do at least the first part of it as an unarmed. I'm spending a meta point. Okay. I always love watching what other people decide to do. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So. So the attack roll on that I uh, beat by eight. Okay. <laughs> um, but I would really like this tape thing to work. So I think I'm gonna spend my Patreon bonus and beat it by 11. Okay. Woo! 
Yeah, that works. That sounds good. So yeah, so you um, you reach into your bag of tricks that Gatling always carries with him, and you start ripping through it, fumbling through it. You find in there this bag of tape that he's made, and uh, yeah, you pull off a stretch of it, and you climb clamber up that barricade and jump on the back of that guy who had been uh, trying to take down King Teddy. And, uh, start, and start with his start eyes and rap. work my way down. I'll start with his cool. mouth and work my way up, rather. <laughs> Are you going to leave the holes so he can breathe, or no? No. So okay. He is uh, able to partially defend himself from this attack. Okay. Um, but you are able to start wrapping him with this stuff, yeah. So he is going to be, um, it is going to impede his, it is going to impede his ability to do anything. I was really hoping specifically for breathing. That's that's fair. That's fair. That's high on his list of things to continue doing. So that's... <laughs> I yeah. breathe constantly. <laughs> um, yes. I'm very deep. Uh, Teddy, head. you're up next. Okay. Is talking a free action? Yes. All right. I'll dust myself off, point at the one who threw me. Mm-hmm. So what kind of man throws another man? Give me your best shot. Assign a boxing stance, and then I commandeer his ass. I like it. And hold until after his action. Cool. So I need the roll on the commandeer. You need to beat a 14. And actually, in your case, I'm also at the... Have you dropped one? No, no, because you're in the right spot, because you're where you are. Yes, you're fine. Ignore what I was about to say. Yeah. Another three. Oh, I beat shit. it by 11. Your dice are magic today. And you even had to roll, you could have rolled D8s instead of whatever you used. I did. He did. Okay, good. Uh, yeah, so you commandeer the big guy, and you do anything with him yet? Yes. Uh, responding to that, I roar, run towards myself, jump up, making a fist, putting my thumb inside of my fingers, and keeping the fist bent, punch myself right in the crown at the hardest part of the skull to shatter his hand. That's gonna hurt. He's gonna do something he would have done anyway. He's just gonna aim for the wrong spot. And do it with bad with technique. Yeah. Again, punching a guy where you should never punch him. So, uh, he comes, so, yeah, so the guy that you commandeer, uh, he is exactly as you say, he looks a little confused for a moment, wraps his fist up, comes running towards you, swings as hard as he can, and uh, and he yeah he made the attack roll, so he managed to hit you. Hard. Um, and in the process, um, just utterly shatters his right hand, and just yells out this just you know howls in pain. Ah! It's one of the first things you've heard him say, other than his bellow mm-hmm. when he first charged you. Um, that is going to severely hamper his abilities in combat. Um, however, I do still need a defensive check from you, um, which actually you can't, you could block it if you want. You have to take the hit. Okay. Because otherwise he can't do it. Uh, blocking would be where? Uh, just give me a defensive check. Okay. With a plus two bonus. And in this case, you can't use your shield because your shield is here. That's fine. Beat it by six. Cool. So yeah, so you take, um, damn. So you take 15 points of damage. Um, and he takes... Uh, a broken hand. <coughs> Hashtag Nick, but you can't see me, but I am applauding right now. <laughs> yeah, no. I Ooh. actually am too, chat, to be honest. That was, that was rad. That was cool. Your ability is really cool. Wow, that was useful. Um, That's a useful ability. Uh-huh. It's a so. terrifying ability. <laughs> it is. I it's can go terrifying. Fuck, I can actually go fuck myself. <laughs> Hi, chat. Thanks for watching the show. It's been fun. That's not what I was thinking of. Um, it's pretty terrible. And you know if Teddy was the one with that power instead of Nick, he'd be we doing made, that all the time. Was there a joke like that made about Johnny Legion early on in the... Yeah, yeah there was. There was. Oh, this show. Okay, so that is what you guys just did. So now we've got the two uh, gladiators who are who've been wrestling. One's writhing in pain and well, the other uh, in duct One tape. of whom just completely shattered his right mm-hmm. hand on Teddy's skull. Um, so he is quite upset, but he still has his left hand. Mm-hmm. Um, the other one is uh, also, you know, angry at the situation. And wrapped in tape. Um, yeah. And they both roll that. So I'm going to be based on your... Oh, he's dealing with you because of the tape. So he's got to get try and deal with this tape situation. He succeeds on that. Time to do that. So he, um, he is able to grab a hold of what you're doing with the tape and start... Sliding off of it. Um, oh, he gets his hand up there? Great. <laughs> you don't want to, yeah. Um, so he uh, he is able to uh, successfully uh, punch you. So I need a defensive check from you to see whether or not you. That's good. I did good. 
Okay, you made you made the check? By six, yeah. Okay, cool. So then he's just gonna try and hit you again. That makes sense too. Um That's so what I you mean, do another defensive check then, please. So he took the tape much. off and punched me twice. No, he's trying to take the tape off with his move. And I made it even with the minus two. Or four. Or the four? Yeah. Okay, cool. Um, and then the guy with the busted hand is gonna take a swing over at Teddy. With his other with hand. Dominant hand. hand. <laughs> his other hand. Dominant hand. I'm aware. I'm Crazy. aware. And he's gonna miss. Um, so that's gonna move us over to uh, Emily and Johnny. You see this balance beam with these swing and bopper thingies that you need to get across. You have a thing? I have a thing too when you're uh, ready. How, uh, how long the distance is my geyser if it's done horizontally? It's a geyser, I imagine it it shoots fairly far. Hmm? How far does my geyser shoot? How far do you need it to shoot? Well, how long is this course? <laughs> Are you trying to blast yourself to the very I end of the entire course? I just blast all three of us to the end of the damn thing if I could do it. Certainly past every stupid obstacle between here and there. You can definitely use it to get yourselves past an obstacle. <laughs> I'm no just going to, however many obstacles, I can just wash us past. You can come. Okay. Um, <laughs> sure. Sure, that makes sense. So give me your roll. You need to be a power check of 14. Yes. Okay. So, In fact, since I know it's probably going to matter, I'm going to beat that by six. Okay. So Johnny, excuse me, Jebediah, tapping into his earlier experiences as Riptide, the aquatic-based superhero. That's, that's, a, that's Wave of the Future. The Wave of the Future. It's good name. <laughs> <laughs> it's required. You have to do it when you do it. All praise Odie. All praise Odie. All praise Odie. He, uh, he does. He taps into that ability, and somehow you manage to just conjure up this blast of geysering water, and you pick up your your team, the three of you, and lift the group over this balance beam through the uh, the boppers and such across the um, the hurdles you're going to have to leap over next, and uh, and past the um, rope swing to land on a podium where before you, you see some more targets. Ah. But these, um, are, these are smaller targets. Oh, this. Uh, are we shooting at the targets? Yeah. What are the targets, no, the targets for? Yeah, yeah. Yep. No, it's just mine. It's just y'all. How, how, how far away from us are the targets? Uh, about 40 feet. Okay. Could always hold your action and let your gunslinger shoot. I believe that is probably the wisest course you know, of action. Actually, though. No, yeah. I would love to let you shoot at whatever you would like to shoot at. Since what are have... the, how many targets? There are four targets. Don't you have four guns? I have two guns. Oh. But I can shoot four bullets. That's excellent. And still have some to spare. I say you shoot them. You go right ahead. Excellent. These are stationary targets. Uh, they are currently, yes. But they have very, they're very hard to hit. You're going to be at a... Uh, five point penalty on each one. I'm going to be at a five point penalty on each one. Correct. I'm taking a meta point. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> um. <sighs> I might just destroy myself here, and I'm just gonna go down that road. I'm going to do. Uh, I'm going to call this shot. Okay. In fact, I'm going to call all four of them. Okay. I assume that the two cages from which the uh, barbarian men were released from are hanging above the stadium. Yes, they were lifted back into the sky after they Excellent. dropped Excellent. Just to make off. this a good show, I'm going to shoot our, all four bullets at those cages precisely so that the bullet bounces off that and hits the dead center of the target. Okay. This is not what I had in mind. That'll be a two-point penalty be, on yeah. top of the five. Yeah, so I know. Seven-point penalty total for each shot. Yep, this is not That's why I said I'm just going to go this, down this road. This is not what I had in mind. Miss Emily Dickinson, That's why I, I said you alone. May Holy Odie guide your role, whose holy sacraments are mayonnaise on milk toast and Bartles and James. However, even though there is a two-point penalty, I do get a two-point bonus for long shots. So that two-point penalty gets canceled out. See what you're saying. Yeah, we'll go with it. It's very far away. It's up in you're the air. You still at the five point, yeah. Give me your roll, In lady. fact, it's closer to Mr. O.D., who we are praising with these shots. Praise his name. Okay. 
All four. First right. one is, uh, wait, so that'd be 14, 5, 19, and I have a plus four. Well, let's back up. Whatever you're trying to do, what's your standard target number? <gasps> Sorry, Dad. Which, it's 16. 16. So you're now, your target number 11. is now an 11. Right. Yep. Okay, so yeah, we do math differently. You do math like Christian does math. Um, it's called the math M-A-T-H. way. To do math. Okay, math. so the, if, okay, so that it's if it's an eleven, um, and I roll a fourteen, and I want to use my plus four, then it's a success. It's yes. Success, then yes. So okay. Let's roll the next one, please. <laughs> you need to beat an eleven. Okay. Okay. Oh, well, that is an eight. Okay. One more. That's good. That's a ten. Okay. Hashtag Rosie, but because anything they can do, she can do better. Anything they can do, she can do better. Oh, I'm using it right now. Okay. That gives me a plus five. So, so now she's going away. So, yeah, she's functioning her stuff. Thank God, because I just rolled a 12. Double sixes. Yeah, so, uh, Rosie, excuse me. Annie whips out both of her six guns, spins them around a couple times, fires off four shots down towards the arena uh, where you guys have been hanging out. I uh, stand and, mistaken. Um, and stand mistaken. The, uh, the shots somehow managed to ricochet off perfectly, such that the bullets come flying back and go ping, 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 ping. I don't suppose there's any chance. Hash like meta that. point, all praise to G-O-D. Who drives O-D home when we behaved as chat as we want to do? Praise to G.O.D. who delivers Kodrai. <laughs> Blessings to the house of O.D. for enduring shenanigans with grace and dignity. Oh, okay, I couldn't Amen. finish the last party. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. Thank so you, what, Chad. The grace and dignity part is not happening at all. What are the, what are the odds that uh, those shots... Well, I'm going to do something with them, don't you worry. I'm enjoying this part, actually. Uh, all the shots went into okay, the targets, the, clearly. Right. The and the crowd went wild. <laughs> The crowd just oh, the like the crowd loved that. The crowd just the lost crowd their minds. That. People started taking off their shirts. They were so excited. Yeah, I have so, no idea. So the we'll say left. that uh, each one of those shots had a um, a twenty five percent chance of perfectly hitting that the cage that it'll drop. Oh well, but I was aiming. She didn't want the cages to drop. She yeah, it happens oh, sometimes. That ooh, one did Trixie, yeah. Trixie Hobbitses, Mr. That Odie. That is a ninety-five. That is going to be two of them. Sweet. So two of the cages are going to drop. Yeah, and that's. We figure out who they might land on. That's Trixie. That's. Yeah. She did not aim there, and she. Mm. Yeah, it's weak cages, though. Poor craftsmanship. Oh, these, are made, these are made in the Something. Empire of North. You turned a success into a horrible failure. <laughs> now we shuffle no, the I, wrath I did of not. OD. Chris <laughs> did. I did it perfectly. Nothing bad has happened. It could crush the it bad guys. Crush the bad guys. That's what I'm you have no idea. Do not provoke the wrath of OD, who has oh. dropped dice upon the floor. <laughs> so let's say it says Major look. Both falling. Both falling. I didn't I didn't look. I did. I didn't look. <laughs> she did. She is also an OD, so it counts. <laughs> Foiled by marriage. <laughs> the Odin family. Nobody family. said everyone ever. <laughs> I was helping you. So, uh, we'll be realistic there. We'll say there's a 40% chance of either one. Hmm, cool. That's 44. And, okay, so, one of the cages is going to hit someone. Um, there are two guys. There's the two of you. So, we'll say um, bad guy, bad guy, three, four. Remember, I'm on four. <laughs> so, yeah, the two cages uh, after the shot goes off. There's this pause as you manage to hit a weak spot on a link on each one. The chain... <laughs> snaps. The two cages come barreling down in sequence. Um, one slams into the ground harmlessly. The other one uh, lands... And, uh, oh, man, the guy with the broken hand. Yes. He's having um, a bad day. He's having a bad day. He's, we're going to yes. say, he's, he's out of play right Whew, now. Things are getting cagey. When Annie, <coughs> when I realize that I have successfully <laughs> helped them, helped them and taken out somewhere there, uh, there is some dancing that is happening from mm-hmm. Annie Oakley, and it is marvelous. She should roll for that. Marvelous. <laughs> yes, can I please get a roll to see you, how well you dance? You can. Body check. 
and then we, if you succeed, oh, we need to see it. how it works. She got a one I got and a two. Three. <laughs> so let, let's see that dance, Seth Dub. <laughs> <laughs> now she went. And she went to a school for this. So I know. I did fun. not. I did not go to a school for dancing. I did not. It's but it's Annie Oakley dance, right? So that's what she would think is cool, right? No, no, no. It's what you think. Well, I'm is pretty cool. sure that I don't know what view chat has right now. I'm pretty I sure it's from like here today. I don't know. <laughs> Do it like that. Okay, I'm dancing from yeah. here. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. It would be like. Uh -huh. I like it. Uh -huh. I like it. It's good. You got your pistols out. <laughs> Are you actually killing people while you're dancing? <laughs> Like, ah. You fired into the audience twice. <laughs> In both like, Give like, me oh. a uh, it's true actually she did. She did just fire. You fired with it was twice. Two shots went off. In both angles is what I meant. Yeah, so we're gonna say there is a there's a high chance you'll hit someone, so we'll figure out what happens. <laughs> but she's the greatest marksman of all time. Which That's increases what I'm the saying. odds that she'll hit someone. <laughs> I'm the greatest marksman of all time. I'm not gonna hit just someone. Shoot their ear out of their hand. No, you it's didn't. Right. You didn't hurt anyone with those two shots. Oh, you can have your chair back. It's all good. Thank you. Uh, so that really was like Johnny dance. and Thank Annie. You. Emily, you are up. The I, yeah, because targets I just, have been shot. You see in front of you. Mm -hmm. um, you see in front of you a uh, a wall climb. Great. I could do that. Yeah. It's no problem. Just a spot I feel like I just showed you how my underwear because I'm wearing leggings. And it's about three <laughs> stories tall. <laughs> it's three stories tall? Yep. Okay, well, I have climbing walls, so I'm yep. going to climb those walls. And yep. I'm going to spend a meta point so that I can climb them easier. Sounds good. You have climbing you walls, your them? buddies don't. Oh. Okay. Oh, do, um, Jonathan, do you have, um, <coughs> a rope? Does anybody have a rope? <laughs> I have a lasso. Can I borrow your lasso, please? Yes! Sorry. I borrow her lasso, and then I climb. It's not three stories tall worth of lasso, but sure, yeah, that'll, that'll be a start. How tall is your lasso? How long is my lasso? And why does the ninja need help climbing? I do not need it's help not her, climbing. It's the others. I'm going right, to climb so up to get and then oh, the dead Miss, weight. Miss Emily Dickinson, if, if the lasso is, is a certain length, then we could, you could always take your ninja star, attach it to the lasso, right? And then shoot it up really high so that it's hanging down so that we can climb or up like you. the 10 feet, right? And then we can get the rest of the way on the lasso. Does sure that make sense? I, I was also thinking that since I am currently yeah. wearing what Emily sure. Dickinson would wear, I could take sure off I the dress yes. that I'm wearing my ninja sure. outfit underneath, yeah, sure tie it to the lasso, yes. and create a longer rope for you, them you, to you climb. You know what else would work would be trouser pants. Yeah, my trouser, trouser pants, pants could come off too. You but take I'm, your pants off. You, 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 <laughs> Yeah, I was bound to happen eventually. I was going to point out that you have a bustle with equipment in it. Yes, but it doesn't have a rope in it. Why not? I'm pretty sure it has a. Silk it has rope a in rope it. in it. Can there I tie it? Know. To the lasso? <laughs> yes. Do, do I need to take off the dress or his pants? Are we? I'm sorry. What? <laughs> are we in character right now? Are we? Jebba does. Yes, yes. Your wife just asked you if she could take off Kelly's Jebba pants. Jebba does. Yeah, just like, fine with her taking off my pants. No, we're good. We're good. Just you can use that rope and so you can just hustle. Will do it. Yeah, Excellent. just get that rope out of your bustle and hustle Hashtag on it. Hashtag meta meltdown, please. And I am looking forward to my wobble next week. Oh yeah, you want a wobble? Thank you. Yeah. Waffle. Somebody Congratulations, we, we got to a wobble. Uh, Gaeka did. Or Gaeka. Ga uh, Gaeka. Ga G A E A C A. Uh-huh. Good congratulations. That's fantastic. So yes, yes I do this. I'm climbing and I'm trailing. Awesome, you're going up there. Behind me. Give me your roll, please. I beat it by two. Okay, so yeah, so you managed to scurry on up that wall, lickety split. Mm -hmm. Like a what? Lickety split. Yep. Like a ninja. And I'm attaching the rope so that they can use that we it. can climb. Mm -hmm. And I will call pointers down to them as well. Climb better! <laughs> I do not need pointers. <laughs> No, I can climb the wall just as good as you. I would never presume. Uh, I'm just then, standing there looking at the, the, the crowd, by the way, is loving this as it's going on. I would I'm never very presume to advise you. Ms. It's been quick, but entertaining so far. <laughs> so, Gatling, you and Teddy find yourself face off with this one last gladiator. Yes, yes, we do. Do uh, you want to go in for another uh, high and low kind of situation, or do you have something planned? Play to the, yeah, play to the crowd, though. They love that shit. Uh, is everybody here? Yeah, the, Gatling really mm -hmm. is good at the playing with the crowd stuff. That's not really my thing. Fine, set him up. I'll do it. Okay. Uh, it's so interesting to have Nick and Crash having this conversation. Uh -huh. Yeah. Oh, I can't. Kind of in each other's heads, dude. Uh -huh. uh, 
I all guess. the boys are full fun. All right. Mm -hmm. I'm going to continue taping. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Avatar, Avatar, pilot, pilot, pilot. Interesting. Mm -hmm. huh. Yeah. I, I continue taping, and then with the end of the tape, once I've finished wrapping, because I'm really only going for eyes and mouth and nose, I can't. Hashtag Rosie, Rosie, Rosie Boo Maggie. Awesome, awesome dance. dance. You showed you not, not one iota of undergarments. undergarments. <laughs> it's true. It's true. Max had your back. She no, was waiting uh, to see. Yeah. What was that called? Making sure. Uh, so, so I take that last like foot of tape and kind of wrap it around my wrist, mm -hmm. and then jump off of him since I'm on his shoulders. Uh -huh. Okay. And basically try and roll myself kind of between his legs to pull him down by the face. Give me the roll. Ow. That sounds, that sounds violent. That sounds brutal. Yeah. Ow. It's supposed to be brutal. Crash doesn't mess around. No. No. <laughs> no. I beat it by one. Cool. He made his defensive check. Yes. So I'm going to say then that he... Oh, and I'm going to use... I'm going to use my bonus that I beat it by a bunch then, actually, and say that the result of that is that he's able to um, free himself a little bit from what you were doing. He still has all this tape around his face. But, but he's no were, longer grappled? But you are no longer grappling him, yeah. Mm -hmm. oh. The tape ripped as he jumped down. Yeah. Did a say? lot with that. Okay. I'm done. Um, then Teddy, you are up, sir. Who? Nick. Nick, you are up, sir. God damn you, Teddy. All right, shirt's coming off. Play to the crowd. Br show the stick. Oh, 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 oh. 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 Yeah. Then yeah. trot, trot, yeah. trot, swing, 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 Ooh. and big stick him. Cool. Uh, sure, give listen. yourself a two point bonus because he's very messed up from this. Tape that is around his oh, face. Oh, I thought it was because of the chest. A red one, please. No, no, no. The, 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 I'm trying not to think <laughs> about that. That's part of it. Blinded by the glare off my winter skin. <laughs> Let's see. Praise be to Odie. <laughs> As we emulate his winter skin. I am king, king of, of winter, winter skin, skin. skin, so that's, that's good. <laughs> What'd you get? I stole my... Uh, I was going to use... Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so that would be a... Beat it by three, but I want to beat it by a lot, so I'm going to use my Patreon bonus to beat it by seven. Sweet. Woo. Yeah, so you come up there and you give him a nice wrap up side of the head with that big old stick. Ah. Just like that. Oh, Thanks, that QQ. Like, it was a gruesome noise, Damn. QQ. Yeah. Um, yeah, that that got him that got him good. He is not in character. My shirt is too very well. Uh, that, you know. It, oh, yeah. That. Uh, there was no nipple alien in there. He didn't show any nipple. Even if he did, you couldn't tell because it's so hairy. They, they, I was being right. told to make sure that we respect terms of service. I'm like, didn't show, he did nothing so. Um, but, very like wise. a young robin chick lost in a nest. Oh. Made you look. And lost his mic. Sorry about the sound coming up. Hashtag ears. <laughs> it's too late Something. now. Exclamation point ears. Sorry. I don't know, guys. Sorry about that. He was so distracted by the chest hair. I love you all dearly. I'm sorry that happened. <laughs> Ash Bowie for life. We still want dancing from everyone. Building toward this some more. Thank you. Also because Uber asked, OD help me. Showed hope everyone has fun. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, everyone. Uh, oh, we have a meltdown. We have really yes. cool. Oh, we've got stuff to use later. Yes. Sweet. Yeah, so there is the guy who's left, and he just got nailed by the sticks. Now he's on his own. Um, he's going to use his actions to try and get this tape off of his face. Um, That's fair. I actually That's rolled a uh, snake eyes. I would do that. I rolled a snake eyes on my first roll. Ooh. So I'm going to say that at least it allows him to have the ability to breathe now. Okay. Um, as well as to, uh, to regain some sight. He's still got this stuff plastered around the sides and such. But How shaven is he? Uh, he is, is it uh, it's question. like a wax thing going on. I know, on, yeah. but uh, before the tape was on him, is he, he pulling is not hair able off? able to act, though, outside of that. Will he have so, eyebrows after this is over? I don't know. <laughs> Are you going to give him some kind of facial if he does that? Uh, yeah, it's going to hurt it's a lot hurt more, is what I'm saying. Emily, Johnny, and Annie, you guys are still, uh, they you got a, a never wall climb to get up. Play. What? You got a wall climb to get up. She's up. I know. You two are. I'm, I'm cheering for them. I'm looking very unimpressedly at all this mm -hmm. and uh, kind of looking annoyed too because I'm stuck in this stupid avatar with this stupid list. And I'm about <laughs> had it up to fucking here with this shit. Jebediah does so curse quite a bit. I'm going to open up my bag. Okay. And I'm going to reach right on in here and I'm going to pull out this nice long stick about this long. Because, see, 
Richard Gatlin's amazing escalating pole vaulting miracle stick mm -hmm. happened to have been left in my bag. That's called gadgets. My gadgets. Mm -hmm. I'm going to jump And then I'm just going to kind of shoot myself right up the wall to the top and land gently as a as a bird but on you, a tree. But there was a rope right there, too. I, I don't care. <laughs> It would be difficult to. I mean, I gotta leave her. I, I gotta hurt, leave her something to fall off. That's true. Okay, so Andy can go up the rope. Yeah. Uh, give me. I need a gadgeteering check. No, a mechanics from you, Richard. If I could please see have... if I made something that isn't going to break if he falls. Yeah. I will well, find but, out. <laughs> but hold it. It's not actually using his. I just called it that. You said that you got it from him. Right, but I've got my gadgets and my gadgeteering. Mm. I'm using the meta box. And I do not have access to any of Gatling's abilities right now. My shirt's mm. still off. And the walking armory. No, what I'm going to say here, and I think this is being fair, is you got the item from Gatling. All right, fair enough. It makes sense. That makes sense to me. Conjuring magically this item from Jebediah's black box doesn't make sense to me right now. All right. So it, I can go with that you got that from Gatling supplies <clears> earlier. <throat> That's totally cool. Are um, you uh, pole vaulting yourself over the wall? To the top. To the top. To okay. the top. So yeah, so I would need some sort of... Um... Engineering roll for me? Yes, please, sir. Okay, and this sounds fair to me. Um, I can't roll any of Gatling's abilities right now. Right now is moot because you would have done made this it already. earlier. Right. Yeah, you would have built it, made it earlier. But what okay. should he roll? Um, let's find out. For fun. Roll as if you were all Avatar. And you said engineering or yes, please. mechanics, so I mechanics, guess? Yes, mechanics, so mechanics plus one as engineering. Okay, yeah, I made that no problem. Sweet. When, when Jebediah gets up to the top of the wall with me, I whisper to him to not alarm uh, Miss Oakley. Jebediah, if, he, if she fails the climbing of the rope, I have a plan to help get her over here, but you're involved. Oh, that's fine. We okay. all gotta get through this. Okay, I just wanted to let you know. Cool. Uh, Annie, it is your turn. Did she Try hear it that? Up. No, I whispered. Yeah, <laughs> and but, I'm but leaving the, the nanobites, I, oh, the I whispered in the other ear. Those ones? Oh, she controls them, so she can turn off. I gotcha. Mm -hmm. I whispered. Well, after seeing, uh, after seeing Johnny uh, l leap through the air, oh God, I've clearly been uh, uh, outdone, and uh, that, that will not stand. <laughs> By any means. Um, what was the uh, obstacle right behind this one? The uh, one we it's can't just, see? It's just a zip line going down. If you ask them, they could tell you. Because we're on the wall. We could see past it. You can't, I'm imagining. The, no, the one behind, the one we just Before came it. through. Oh, behind you? You said it was targets, wasn't it? Um, no. Before you shot. That's no. it. It was the targets and the balance. <sighs> Yeah, you. It was. Um, it was. It was some bars that you would have had to swing across. Behind us. Yeah. That we p surpassed. Coming Excellent. Along. And uh, how long is our rope? Very long. Very long. It's, it's very long. long. It goes to from the top. top to the bottom where you are. And there's still a pole there too. Excellent. Then we're also tied. Okay. Yeah. I am. I'm going to take the end of the rope mm -hmm. and attach it to the target with a bullet. <laughs> <laughs> End of the rope, which is hanging. Yeah. I am grabbing the end, putting it on the target, and attaching it to the target with a bullet. How, how, it it's not like work. a staple. Uh, have you ever heard of a nail gun? Oh, well, that's so, true. So, so that's what, true. what is your goal here? I am going to tie rope awesome. up the rope to the top of the wall. <laughs> tie rope, walk up. You can't. You can't. You can't walk up a tightrope vertically. Not with that attitude. It's an angle. I can just. Do, 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 do. It's not that long. It's. I mean, it's. It's. It's a three-story building. All right. I fine. Mean, okay. Fine. Okay, I am fine. being so generous by letting okay, you guys the high know about the Oh, brave the generosity of the Odie. <laughs> you should for the love. Oh, All right. Plan, you guys plan, plan B. Rope. Plan B. Come up with another way of getting around. Okay. That's when I shoot sense. the rope with the bullet, I realize there's no way it's gonna stick. So then I have to go to Plan B. Thank you. I still see this as a. An opportunity to one up him. So uh, I'm I'm going to take the end of the rope and go back as far as I can. Okay, it's not very far because this rope is it's about like, the length of the height. So you're think of to the go. hypotenuse. It doesn't. Yeah, it's, but it's still out. 
Okay, not it's, very much. It's, it's you're dangling able to get a down. few feet away from the thing. I said as far as it goes, it doesn't matter. Right, Just let me do I'm the thing. Sorry, your grappling bullet didn't work, sweetie. Seventeen point <laughs> three this. inches away from the oh, tower, you were able it. to get yeah. with yeah. the yeah, end of the did. rope. That's but, fine. I don't care how far it is. I'm still doing my okay. thing. The you, math you, doesn't you, matter. You pull back seventeen point <laughs> three inches. I'm pulling back seventeen point three freaking inches. Yes. If I knew metric, I'd do that instead because it's a more logical system. Of oh, metrics. I would hate. Okay, okay. Roughly okay. two centimeters. Right. Go. So, so I pull it back the seventeen point three inches. Yes. And then I jump so that my feet are on the. Ah, well, and you're gonna uh -huh. walk up this way. Yeah, we could have gotten this a lot freaking faster. If you started with that, yeah, we could have. Well, I am descriptive. <laughs> but what uh, Rad, I call down to her. I call down to her as she's starting this. Um, <sighs> Miss Oakley, that looks very cool, and you are certainly gonna one up Jonathan. Um, I do recommend that perhaps you tie the rope around your waist because then you could get a swinging party going and it would be more interesting to the crowd. Oh. Hold on, I would just I'm like to sure point out that she party. just invited us all to a swinging party. <laughs> I'm sure the crowd would be very entertained by a swinging party. But Bully. a swinging... That's not what's on the uh, agenda tonight for the Cow Palace. I, oh. I just, I'm trying to advise, I'm trying to well, encourage cool, I'm her give my buggy keys too. to tie the rope around and I'm trying to think of a way that would encourage her to do right. that. And so I'm telling she her this. No upon hearing... Is, just to point that Ms. out. Ms. Yeah, Ms. Emily, upon, I agree, <laughs> Miss Emily Dickinson. Swinging would be more exciting. However, tying a rope around one's waist is for losers. <laughs> and so I'm then going, it's only I get 17.3 inches. I get so it. I'm going to walk all the way to one edge of the wall and then I'm going to push away from it so I can swing around to this side of the wall and then crawl up a little bit. It's going to be like a pendulum act, right? Now, do you shoot each end of the rope into the wall again as you get to the other side? No, I've never, uh, uh no. Like pythons. <laughs> right. Yeah, as you ascend the mountainside. That's please, just... please, Annie, please no, tie I, I... the rope to something on it reminds you. Me the time you don't need to Bill roll. Bill Hickok climbed Mount Everest. I'm going to roll. Please, please tie something to something. So, Annie wraps, does not tie herself around this rope. Oh, she begins you... to pendulum herself from side to side. Going up a little up, bit each time. Yes, up. The wall. And halfway the crowd through, has I think no I want to stop and do like a. What to make of this insane woman who is doing this? But yep. she does successfully make it up to the top oh, good. of the wall. Once she reaches the top of the wall, she and her three companions approach the zip line. Two companions on the side approach the zip line, grab onto it as all three and go barreling straight down. The momentum from this carries them rolling past the next obstacle that they were supposed to deal with, and they find themselves crossing the finish line to the adoration of the crowds for setting a new speed record. They've never seen anyone go this fast before. Meanwhile, down in the arena, the other guy who was still set to fight with Richard and with King Teddy, uh, in the midst of an attack, loses his balance and stumbles backwards accidentally into the cage he'd been in before, which is the door is wide open. And King Teddy, being a man of wisdom and strength and Germanship. intelligence, couldn't think of this, but that's okay because Nick is in charge right now. And Nick has enough foresight to take the stick and close the hatch and then takes the stick and shoves it through the lock locking the man inside, whereupon the crowd screams and cheers in joy that they have managed to see the defeat of these two gladiators by King Teddy and Gatling in the center of the arena in quite an amazing and miraculously creative manner. I think The announcer yells out to everyone, Bravo! Bravo! Bully! Bully! Fantastimiscimo! Whatever the hell! And says, congratulations to our fine uh, entertainers tonight. You've done an amazing job in the arena. We applaud you. We will sing ballads and write odes spelled the right. same way. They are pronounced Odie in this land. May he be praised. And they allow you all to exit the arena whereupon the emperor says to you all, oh, my friend, I am so proud of you. You have 
won the wager. You have uh, uh, you, you, all debts are off. I am so impressed. You're an amazing man. Here's your supplies. Here's a train heading down to LA. You hop on that train, leave the empire of San Francisco, head all the way down to Los Angeles, whereupon- I forgot you... my best hat at the hotel in San Francisco. <laughs> we must turn the train around immediately. Back we go to San Francisco. <laughs> You left your hat in San Francisco? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I left my hat in San Francisco. Once you reach Los Angeles... <laughs> I think it's funny that he, he thought that like, maybe we would go through that quickly. I think it's funny that we actually are literally being railroaded. It's <laughs> 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 like, we're just gonna go. Chat caught that other hand. <laughs> um, yeah, like, the... Uh, once you reach Los Angeles, you're able to uh, to be to make contact with um, Dona Maria Valdez, Valdez de Villa, mm -hmm. and uh, she um, speaks to you guys at uh, a, a one of the safe houses that she has set up around the city. Um, the city of Los Angeles uh, is the capital of the, the Duchy of Los Angeles, right? And um, and she is quite aware that the allegiances in the in the region are not always clear cut. Um, she corroborates for you what you had been told at the beginning of your adventure that um, that it does appear that the Archduke is um, waffling, no pun intended, as to which direction he should go, who he should support, and it really seems to be contingent on what happens um, with this mission to the dam. Oh. As one of the leaders of the alliance, he has been briefed of the situation. And he does not seem um, all that optimistic that you'll be successful, um, but he is willing to acknowledge in conversations that she has heard um, that if that power plant can be stopped um, and the impact of it negated, uh, it's quite likely um, that the uh, the alliance can start making more progress down in the southwest. So he's playing both sides and trying to have it. Are, are sitting we, on the fence. Are we yeah. in the same place on the on the scale on the slider? That we were when the fight ended? Yes. Okay. For days? Let me know when I would have a chance to talk to him. You would have had a chance to talk to him on the train to LA. Okay. Hashtag meta point, nothing clever to hear here. Carry on as you were. Thank you. Aw, thank you. So we have that conversation? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. So uh, we'll back up just a second, and you guys are free to have conversations that would have taken place on the train to LA. Um and deal with any buffs and or points you want to use. Okay. So just when we get a chance and no one's looking, yeah. take him aside. I'm writing poetry. Lose the wasp. You're good. I can see why the program wants you. Draw it out as long as you can. I gotta go. And use a meta point and go. <laughs> Gatling! What a fantastic, mantastic, I like that word. I shall start using it in conversation. What a mantastic display we put on for the good people of my friend King Norton, Emperor Norton. I degraded him just there because I trounced him so thoroughly. Did you use your buff or points? My buff. Yeah. I can get you out. <laughs> no need, good friend. No need. Once this war is done, we shall see our way into a bright and game-filled future. Okay, well, if you change your mind, let me know. I can get you out. A mind like a speeding bullet does not change once fired. It hits its target. If it's aimed properly, yeah. That's... Indeed. I noticed that my nano wasp is not in his ear anymore, so I send it back. Oh, sorry. <laughs> that's fair. Nice. Oh, right. I'm in. <laughs> bullet. 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 Ah, be Um. I don't build anything. <laughs> <laughs> I've written several poems about the destructiveness of war and the inevitability of death. <laughs> I wax my chest. <laughs> but I do go, th go through all of my supplies over and over again just totally. to make sure that... Are you going to stay as crash? Uh, yeah, I don't want to spend the meta points just yet. It makes sense. And Are we... I'm get I actually, for the first time, got some actual work done. <laughs> I'm... I'm, I'm going to look at some of Gatling's... Uh, for the five minutes that I was crashed, so... I'm, I'm, I'm going to look at some of Gatling's inventions. I'm going to stick it out regardless of the discomfort. Try to fix them. Okay. 
So um, you guys are in L.A. and you are getting ready to... Um, Los Angeles. Spanish for the Angelus. A professor, hmm. uh, King, uh, I believe it's the angels, actually, if you look at the root of the word. Um, City? I mean... The, well, that would be oh, La chat. Ciudad, yes, but... Chat, chat, chat. Um, so, while you guys are in L.A. No, no. Um, speaking with uh, Maria, um, word comes to her that there has been an incident downtown. Downtown LA? Yeah. Wait, Wait did Chris, Chris just get a show back, back on the rails? On the rails? <laughs> All praise OD, performer of Miracles, hashtag MetaPoint. <laughs> thank you. Praise it his won't name. last. That's awesome. But thank you. Um, and uh, uh, yeah, no word comes to Maria that, um, and this is right about as you guys are about to, to set off. Um, she set you up with a, um, there is a, for lack of a better term, a industrialist sympathizing um, faction, railroad uh, baron, oh. um, who does have a train set to head out to Phoenix. Um, in the not distant future, the not too distant future. Not too distant future. Thank you. Next Sunday, AD. Um, <laughs> next morning. Okay. And uh, the plan is for you five plus Franklin, because he's still stuck with you. Poor Franklin. Uh, the plan is for you guys to head out towards the dam. Mm -hmm. uh, or towards Phoenix, on his at least. railroad, the, the on this, sympathizer's yeah, railroad. it's one of the safest ways to get you in there. Okay. Okay. Um, just because there are so many, there are so many people concerned about spies and enemy agents and things like that. That okay. um, going in this way will give you at least a certain degree of cover, as long as you don't reveal yourself too much. Mr. Roosevelt, may, may I suggest the black bear? King Roosevelt. King Roosevelt. And but yes, you may. Stealth bear. Ste I realize that sounded racist when it came out. I did not mean it that way. I meant the stealth one from the other episode. Ah, uh, okay. My stealth bear, Clancy. Clancy the stealth bear. Indeed. He has his own show. Uh, you know, you've seen so much cool in history books. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to respond to that, so I shall laugh in discomfort. <laughs> um, so, but that evening, um, word, word comes out to you that or comes out, to, or excuse me, a messenger uh, shows up at uh, Maria's uh, villa. <laughs> the Via's villa. That's kind of. That's the same word, isn't it? Uh huh. One's the way. Uh huh. You got. Hey, Elodie, for getting it. It took me a. Almost. We're Hail Odie, yeah. master of languages. Yeah. You know, you could have taken care of that in like one episode of Dora the Explorer. <laughs> <laughs> she is so annoying. She, the way she speaks. Yeah, that's because she's a child and kids are annoying. No, but that's it's what the, they do. It's that way that sometimes some words are said really loud. Like, who does that? Yeah, that, that Dora. That. Holy Dora. Odie does that. <laughs> he whose voice modulation. <laughs> okay, so we got word. It's There's an incident. We need to go fix it. Maria, so we get on the train. Maria gets word that um, downtown <laughs> there has been an incident. Is it a rat? That we need to fix before we can get on the train. Let's go. Yes, there's been an incident at the zoo. Oh. The LA zoo. And apparently, a group of gorillas Nazi have gorillas. broken free. Okay. Oh, is it, it's going to be no. They are not Nazi gorillas. <laughs> oh, thank God. That was yeah. the prequel to the show, the beta testing. They're just normal gorillas. They fought Nazi gorillas during beta testing. Gorilla gorillas. Yeah, oh, yes. Yeah. They were gorilla, 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 gorilla. They were Nazi. Gorilla. We'll go back to gorilla that sometime. Gu gorilla, guerrilla. No, yes. no, no. no, no. What, what is this about gorillas? You know, the gorillas have broken loose and From... are rampaging through downtown, uh, killing civilians. Oh. And a couple of them have climbed on top of a building and are yeah. throwing things down to the populace. Um, in downtown Phoenix, L.A. LA. LA. We're not, we yes. have to fix this problem before we can get on. The train to go to Phoenix the local because the person do not seem to be able to deal with it. Yeah, that does seem really bad for the people oh. of L.A. The town has gone apeshit. I, I wonder if if 
But we're going to Phoenix, right? Indeed we are, but I think we may be able to curry favor with the undecided gentleman were we to help him with his ape problem. Uh, what if we let the gorillas just run rampant the and then we just kill that guy? Then it's only one the, guy we'd have to kill as opposed to five gorillas. Then I have to make the gorillas show up again later because chat got them. Oh. oh. They're a oh, gift. Oh, I see chat. They're a gift. They you got us some attack. gorillas? I, I do oh, not think chat, chat thought through the know? fact that uh, we have many people who have weapons with which taking care of the gorillas. Okay. We also have a, a that person was dressed a in a black sentence. bear suit. Do you know what I think would look wonderful on King and Teddy? A gorilla suit? A gorilla suit. Most of the gorillas seem to have taken up uh, a position at a local, co- at a construction site. Oh, good. There are girders and... Barrels? Barrels and... Ladders? Ladders. Chat, I take back oh, what I said. Oh, for F's sake! How could you do that, Chet? Some of the barrels are on fire. Now I get it. Now I get it. And mm-hmm. at least one of the gorillas did climb gr- to the top with a uh, not that attractive blonde woman in a pinkish dress. We can't say we didn't bring. Is this it the redhead in the yellow dress you know, that everyone forgets? She's probably about? under a lot of stress, and I'm sure she's beautiful inside. Yeah, no, she's very. Uh, her her face is very angular, like almost pixelated. Yeah. I see. I see what you did there. Yep. Yep. Really pronounced one eye. <laughs> so you're basically just block shaming then. That's fine. I'm block shaming. You're right. You're right. She is beautiful in her own way. Eight All right. beauty. She's beautiful for 1983. Yeah. So let me let me guess to, to get to the top. So Sarah, video games are these things people I, th- play. I was just making sure that I Donkey Kong. Yes. I, I wrote it down. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Wait, I didn't, what? My parents did not buy what? me video games, and I was only two in 1983. So what, what in the hell is a Donkey Kong? But anyway, that's what's going on downtown. Is yeah. there's a hostage oh, okay. situation involving yeah. gorillas, barrels, and a construction site. All right. I hate love chat. I love chat. Okay. Well, I've never been so happy so let's go to there. be playing. Well, the first, first, be careful. Professional We're gonna have video gamer oh going into this God. situation. <laughs> go crash, go. Guys, I got this. <laughs> All right. First, be careful as you cross the road. There are several semis and a lot of frogs, and for some reason, alligators in that canal. Yeah, yeah that's okay. I know the pattern. And at some point, a guy in a oh. with a paper route comes by and flings a newspaper. Annie, Annie Oakley it. is just opening a beer and gonna watch Crash. So yeah. you uh, you head downtown. Just yeah. remember, it was Beauty that, that killed the beast. Hash Bowie for life. Oh, there it is. Well, we got there it. it. Is. It's time. <laughs> Oh, that caught it. Happen? Oh, it yeah. did happen. Uh, QQ, can we QQ up the, uh, the song song? <laughs> hey, yep. is it going to be Donkey song Kong Song song QQ'd. No, it's a theme. We got the dance music. Masters, masters of the metaverse. QQ, you got to join us. The bear is dancing. Thank you. I gotta stop flipping you off. There's too many gifts of that now. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yes, but you know, depending on. on what side I'm sitting on, those could be going to anyone. It's true. They just all over the place. Birds for days. Um, yeah. So you guys make it downtown, where this situation has has started, and the uh, there's some of the local cops there around, and they just they just don't know what to do. Their weapons don't seem to be of any use against these gorillas. Is one of the cops a giant mouse? No. But nice oh. reference. Are we meta meltdowning? Uh, oh god, please no. Are we rule of cooling? I think we'll have you rule of cool first. Okay, as ourselves. Yeah. Okay. Sarah, this is the time when Christian has crashed. Could just destroy this. Don't ruin this. <laughs> I'm not trying not to ruin it, but <laughs> I, know, I also kidding, want to make sure Chat gets all the things. I know. I know. We have an hour. It's okay. But yeah, so you. Um, <laughs> it's actually not your job to move things along. Me? <laughs> just, just throwing that out there for you. I know, I can't I can't not. It hurts. It hurts. Okay, so you take over in two weeks. Oh no. Oh. I just backseat drive. 
<laughs> no safe place to go there. Um, All right, roll a cool. We can roll a cool this. Yeah, we can. Actually, no, that's, that's a good point, though, now that I haven't looked at what we all have to play with for a moment. Got um, a little cool in a minute. Uh, yeah, they just yelled at me for pointing cool. that out. Please use a um, meta meltdown so someone else has to wear this. <laughs> but not right now. Let's let Crash defeat Donkey Kong. I, I tell the game. you what, odds <laughs> evens, odds meltdown, evens rule of cool. Because right. I do want to use at least one. And you have mentioned that I have dropped them often at the same time. And so I, I do want to give you some opportunities. So uh, odd, even, odd was meltdown, even was rule of cool. So eight. Rule of cool. <sighs> okay. So when you get there, um, you are informed by. Uh, I'm not going to do it. I almost just endowed a stereotypical Irish police officer, yeah, and do I just it. don't want to do it right now. Um, but I really want to hear you do the voice. <laughs> it's pretty bad, isn't it? I don't know. Uh, I want to hear it. See, now I can't get it out of my mouth. <laughs> I just use it. No, no, no. So uh, you get down there and... I can't uh, get it out of my mouth. The words of Holy Odie. <laughs> Entendres, 416. And at the beginning of the day, Holy Odie said, Top of the morning to you. <laughs> so, Odie! <laughs> so, you find yourselves downtown at the construction site. And uh, yes, they, you've been told that there are multiple gorillas in, the, in, in this building. Uh, they've climbed up into it, uh, but they had to, you know, just you, faces and things. Ah, um, they've... <laughs> They're snarling. I, oh, Q -Q broke Lord. That sounds like a cow fart is what it sounds like. <laughs> so yeah, so they, um, they have taken up a, um, a position inside this construction site. Um, there appear to be um, about a dozen gorillas okay. round about through this building. Um, the zoo is hoping that you can uh, take them alive <laughs> because they are a very popular attraction. Mm -hmm. Well, there's so many. They are. They are. And um, at the same time, everyone is aware that there is this poor woman who is being held hostage, presumably near the top of the building. And spoiler alert, she is. Yes. Oh, well, now we know. Mystery God. <laughs> All right. Um, do we roll initiative? Yeah, let's get initiative. Let's go. And we're rule of cooling? Mm -hmm. Yeah, first thing we do is roll of cool. What you guys see is a, uh, one, two, three, four, you see about a five-story building, oh, um, which is crap. about the tallest that they can make in this, time, Ooh, in this, in this area. Oh, they okay. can get taller. Anyway, um, there's a lot of um, open spaces on the walls. You see uh, gorillas um, looking right. out down and... Okay, go on. <laughs> out at you guys. Silver down, like silverback. A couple of them are, yeah. Some big ones hanging out. And um, and every once in a while, they'll take something from um, like a, you know, a good-sized barrel or box and fling it down at the ground. It'll come crashing um, in, into, the, uh, into the street below. Okay. And that's what you see. All right. So yeah, I need initiative from everyone. Thirty-five. Thirty-five. What? I know. Eighteen. Okay. Twenty. Okay. Twenty-one. Okay. No, that's the wrong kind of die. Thirty-six. What? For serious? Oh, crash. Crash. <laughs> Makes more sense now. Rolled good too. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so Crash, what would you like to do in this situation? Well, uh, this is really like the moment that I've been training for my whole life. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. And a lot of people probably don't know this about Crash, but he's a, he's a professional gamer and Donkey Kong is kind of what got him into the whole idea of, of, of being a gamer professionally because you know, always going, going to that high score. And and, yeah. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna suss out the pattern using my ultra vision 
And then I'm going to rip off my outfit. You're all hearing this, right? Oh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Like, tear away Hulk Hogan style, rip off my outfit, revealing a Legend of Zelda cosplay underneath. And then I realized that's the wrong one. So I ripped that off. And there's the Mario outfit. Got the overalls. Put on the little hat. I, uh... I grab the that his the, the pogo stick right out of his bag that Gatling gave him and I jam it into the side of one of the barrels so now I've got this big pogo hammer and I just go. <laughs> and every time something gets in my way like a barrel or a monkey, gorilla, <laughs> smash smash smash. But the idea is not to not to get all the gorillas knocked out, but really to platform my way to the top. And, uh, and and save the damsel in distress, or rather the uh, pixelated woman who appears to be upset about something, possibly being tied up at the top of a building by 12 gorillas, who somehow tied her up. That, that was an excellent description of what you would like to do, Crash. Thank you for that. Um, since you went first, King Teddy, why don't you go second? Pass. I want to watch Crash do that thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what happens if we all pass? No, you have, no, it's a you gotta, you gotta play. It's, you it's gotta in play? the rules. Yep. I don't know. I'll challenge Donkey Kong to a rap battle or something. I don't know. You're gonna challenge, you're gonna challenge one of the gorillas to a rap battle? Donkey Kong to a rap battle. I, I guess. The King Gorilla. The King Gorilla. Sure, whoever the King is Gorilla. The you challenge to a rap battle. Yeah, don't vote for me. <laughs> um, well, see. You might have uh, just simul- just. You might have just picked the one thing that's actually gonna beat. <laughs> God damn it. Can I pay attention to things? Chat, I'm, don't I'm waiting hate for us. him to, to grab the pole Please. out of my bag, and I'm grabbing his rail gun out of the other bag. Okay. And I'm setting it up and holding my action so that whenever he gets up to anything that might actually hit him, uh-huh. I'll just have that rail gun shot. Okay. And I'm just going to hold my action to his actions every round. Okay. So you, something so you're going to hear a track crash as he's trying oh, to go yeah. up through this thing and fi- t- do some suppressing fire. Yeah, help me out with an extra life or something. Yeah, throw, what, throw a watermelon at me in case I lose health. I like it. Can I change my action? No. Can't. Sorry, you've already locked it in. King Teddy, may I... Uh, <laughs> King Teddy, may I ask a boon of you? Yes. <laughs> so, but he can't grant it. Because no. he's already locked it in. No, no, no. I just need his permission to take oh. the black bear suit. You may take Clancy. Okay. Thank you for l- lending me Clancy. I have <laughs> um, disguise makeup as something that Emily is very you good do. at. You do. You do have that. So yes. I will quickly disguise myself using the black Clancy bear to be a, uh, as gorilla-like as I can. <laughs> so I'm... And I still have my ninja outfit, so I I look very gorilla like. I just want to say for the record, chat, please, dear God, no one make fan art of this. Please don't do Thank that. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Um, Thus ensuring. <laughs> I never thought I'd see Miss Dickinson in a teddy. Oh. Oh. <laughs> That's fan art. Chris wouldn't mind oh. actually. The, um. <laughs> that that was a uh, that was well timed, sir. What time? It is hot in here. So anyway. Oh man. I get gorilla gussied up, and then um, because Gorilla. they would not suspect me as a foe, I just gorilla saunter up to one of them, and then I would use my boosted ability once I'm very close to one as a swarm attack and <laughs> swarm attack. Them. I do love that that's the sound effect for swarm attacks. A, what? I didn't. I didn't figure I could climb five flights of stairs to get the girl. The could I do that? Because I would rather do that. If you make the right noises when you jump. Okay. I would like to do that. I want to dress like a gorilla, jump up and get the girl and take her back to Sneaking. safety. You're going to start climbing the uh, As a gorilla, yes, okay. because okay. I'm mimicking actions. I don't want I them to see. think I'm a foe. I'm with you. Annie, what are you going to do? Uh, well, I assume there is a grocery store in the nearby area. It's downtown LA. Absolutely. Excellent. Yeah. Annie knows quite a bit about guns, but... She, uh, not so much about animals, so she assumes that gor- I heard Pogo Hammer. Does anyone know if John Egbert was involved? I don't know. Maybe the thought of that just stuck a little at home in my heart. Hashtag MetaPoint. Now that the inevitable MSPA reference was made. This show has won the internet. Thank you, Chad. It's about time we won the damn we won internet. The internet. We've been in the party for, for so long. Mm-hmm. Every year, but we just kept going. I want to thank all the haters who brought us to mm-hmm. this. Oh, there's not very many. 
So, uh, assuming that gorillas are obsessed with bananas, uh-huh. mm-hmm. uh, I am going to a local grocery store and taking <laughs> as many bananas are you paying as for I the bananas? possibly many of those, can. As many of them winter bananas? Are you paying for the bananas? There is a crisis. She said no, taking. I'm it's taking winter them. here, which means that in some tropical regions, these actually are oh. it's a good time. To... Yeah, with all that overseas trade we've done. That we do. Yeah. Oh, well, this is, that's all the empire of San Francisco is known for. Oh, but we're in L.A. Of course, right. yeah. of course there's, there's no there's problem. Huge you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna do a banana thing This, this is the logical breakdown. This is where we've drawn the line. No. Two Irishmen looking for work see a sign that reads, Tree Fellers Wanted. Patty says, oh no, what a pity there's only two of us. Hashtag Metapoint. <laughs> Oh God, it was so bad. Dehydrated. It was bad, Chet. You know. <laughs> All right, thank you, Chet. And here I was just thinking that the gorillas wouldn't be discovered till 1936. So, so, so once I have the so, bananas yeah, in yes. hand, uh huh, I'm going to, so, to run back to the scene of the crime. Now, Crash has informed us that the barrels will be coming out at certain speeds and rates. He informed you of no such thing. Okay, he didn't. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry, Gatling might have told you. Crash is not going to talk to you. Do I notice that barrels are being thrown? Yes, Come. being thrown, yeah. Thank you. I'm going to- But it's some sort of primitive attempt at random randomization. It doesn't matter. Just that they're being thrown. They're being, mm-hmm. a, thank you. Yeah. So uh, I'm gonna put the bananas down. When a barrel is taken out, I'm gonna collect the barrel and then I'm gonna hold the banana, and when Crash, when he's going through, it seems like he's gonna get attacked, I'm gonna shoot the banana, which will hopefully upset the gorillas. Hashtag, yeah, they get really mad. remember any, there is always money in the banana stand. Nice. There is, there is. always we money. Did we do another Arrested Development earlier? Yes, we did it. And then, and then I'll throw oh, the banana in the barrel, <laughs> hoping that they want to come after the so banana. The shot banana. You're gonna hold, Bananas, bananas hostage. hostage. Yes. So, um. It's the my banana, shot banana. <laughs> but in so, hopes, in hopes of helping to distract so that Crash can get through the course more easily. I, I, don't I know. feel like I, you I, have I, a better chance just like holding one banana and stroking it. Miss Annie Oakley does not do such acts in public. So I With gun. That we have, uh, that we, we, you've each, you've given your, your, your thing. So let's. Recap. Yes, recap please, so chat may vote. Uh, balls out Donkey Kong style. I hide in the shadows. <laughs> Rap battle with King Gorilla. Yeah, yeah. Side note, please remember, win or lose, you have to do the action. <laughs> so do you. Don't worry, the gorilla. I was misinformed yeah, on the rules. That means you have to do the, the rap battle. Cool. I know. Okay. Okay, I'll get I'll get ready. <laughs> I'm, I'm, we're going. It's gonna go full bananas. You don't even know. Uh, oh, the watch. Oh no no no. Bananas. I'm, I'm, I'm playing Overwatch. Oh, right. With, uh, That's right. That's right. You have the sniper right, right, right. Like yeah. Winston. Um, I'm dressing like a gorilla and subverting the gorilla intelligence and climbing up the building to rescue the maiden. You're going to subvert the gorilla patriarchy? and Yes. Yeah. Okay. I'm holding bananas hostage and putting them in barrels, hopefully so that monkeys will come, and then we'll have monkeys in a barrel. Uh, oh, Lord. Gorilla. Barrel she really monkeys. wants the monkeys to come in the barrel. Why? Why? Well, I don't know, because they're gorillas. Okay. Annie's not very good at animals. Annie's not good at animals. Well, if you're trying to make... No. Nope. Don't. <laughs> never mind. I don't even know what you were going to so say. So we'll see the vote. The vote will happen, and we'll see what happens. Oh, God. I know. It hurts. This waiting period is, like, the worst part. Uh-huh. Oh. Well, I don't expect to oh, win. Oh, God. Oh, God. You have... To... Oh. oh, no. I haven't looked at that. Oh. I'm not at that. No. I don't want to know voting. Oh god, oh god, oh god. I know it'll just depress me. It's like almost everybody voted for the damn bananas. <laughs> no, my or plan the rap battle. should work with, it works with Crash's plan. <laughs> I know. Well, it does, he still is going to do his plan, whether or not the chat votes for so, it. So, yeah, I'm yeah. going for it either way. Good, yes. We do have a winner. <laughs> and... Bananas? It is Crash. Oh, there you go. Oh, thank God! <laughs> thank you, Chad, for having a soul. Chad! <laughs> You make dreams come true. And because Crash, I've been waiting for this moment for like 14 episodes. Crash did win this show. Crash did. Crash gets to go first. Oh, so. Defeat the king in one round, please. <laughs> and then 
that none of us have to go. Exactly. But that's not what my action was to do. I wasn't trying to defeat the Correct. king. I'm Saving going to save the human person. And I don't want to really hurt any of the gorillas unless they get in my way, in which case they get pogo so, heavy. If you knew the um, game, you knew she's not interactive deco. It's not an actual person. <laughs> so uh, I don't need your roll because you won the chat uh, vote. So you will have a criti critical success. So yeah, so um, Richard Gatling behaves in a way that It's is a me! Crash! A little different than you've seen I'm him act before. Tally, man, tally, me bananas. Daylight come and me want me waffle. Hashtag meta point. <laughs> Thank Great you, chat. chat. They know that they're really close to a second waffle, so they're. Uh, oh. If, if they may have actually even hit it there. Um, so, I'm excited for these. Yeah, so points. crash. You do. I mean, I'm just trying to get to the top. Maybe knock so, a couple gorillas around. Gatling rips off his coat, um, and underneath he is dressed head to toe in this green tunic with a little belt tied around. Professor, that's As he very pulls off his hat, there's this kind of like greenish, um, you know, uh, almost like a kerchiefy type hat sitting up here uh, and such, white, uh, glistening arms sticking out from this tunic, and then he looks down at himself and says, Shit! Rips that off quickly! Because you said Zelda first. Hashtag my uh -huh. point hand banana might have something to say about holding bananas hostage. He would <laughs> definitely prefer them stroked than squashed. Praise be to O.D. and the gorilla army, whose barrels are to be feared. Thank you, chat. Thank you. He's not uh, happy. He's feeling bad. Pulls off the tunic, flings it down, and yeah, now he's dressed in this odd uh, collection of suspenders. Of primary of colored overalls and shirt, yeah. Yeah, and, and later on, I'm not even sure Gatling will have any idea why he decided to prep this way today. He, but it's, it's it, I mean, for anybody who's worked with him before, you can tell it's Crash. I mean... Oh, yeah. yeah. I, just, so you reach it, over to uh, the bag, that the satchel that uh, Appleseed had, pull out from it the pogo thingamajigger. You slam it into the side of the barrel, so that's a big hammer shape. Oh, and you pick it up. Uh huh. And uh, I'm gonna say, I think you should use your Titan thing. It's just to have the strength yeah, to pull I, this I, off. Yeah, I like the idea that I like smash the hammer down on the ground to launch myself up in the air, like a reverse strength test. Uh, <laughs> you know, hammer pogo. I love sense. that idea. Uh, so he just goes running in with this huge hammer that he's and built yeah, out of a pull barrel. Pull off the Titan punch. Let's just... thing. And starts running in, and and from and you guys actually see him when he first enters the building. Oh yeah. Um, because the lower floor of the building is more or less complete. Um, but you do at one point, uh, you hear this um insane cackling from inside. The crash <laughs> is really happy about the situation, and he does keep saying, "It's me, a crash you know? <laughs> like, Dude. With the occasional booyah. Yes. <laughs> and uh and and while that is going on, um, at one point a gorilla comes flying out of one of the windows on the first floor. Um, <laughs> it just goes slumping into the street from this. And um, and then there's kind of a pause, and then uh, a couple more come flying out from the uh, the second floor, and also just kind of land. And they aren't dead, but they're definitely dazed. And the uh, zookeepers who had shown up um, waiting for someone to somehow do their job for them, because um, realistically that's what's happening here, um, they, they start tending to the wounded gorillas and taking care of them and, and whatnot. And um, and yeah, after a little bit, um, uh, a fourth gorilla comes out as well. And um, and so that is my turn Crash's now. action. Nice. Just Does he get through. to the top to the princess? Stick my head out the window. Not in one Not round. Quite. No. No. Not quite. Not in one but round. I do, I do stick my head out the window. I did something! <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Then I back in. Next up is Emily. All right, so I want to disguise myself Yes. And I want to climb up the walls. Yes, you're a three-point penalty. Yes, I know. Yep. And I want to try to, can I, how far up the walls can I get, sort of depending on how I roll? Yeah. Okay, and uh, against against the gorillas noticing me, I want to use my Jenica buff. Okay. So they so they have a sure harder that. time noticing that I am That's fine, human. Yeah. Um, well played. Mm. What? Are you all the way around Avatar? I'm all the way Avatar, yeah. Uh, you can't use your buff if you're all avatar. What? Because the buff is something Jenica can tap into, and when you're all avatar, you have no access to Jenica. Use a metal point. We've got a bunch. Oh. A bunch of metal points. You I know, but I want to use the little dice to do the disguise thing. So then use four of them and get all the way to the other side. Huh? We have yeah. a few. So use spend a some, then spend some more when but you're done. But then I don't have climbing walls. So use a metal point. Okay, using a metal point. Now you activate. Now I'm gonna activate the buff. Then I'm gonna use another meta point. Hold on. Correct. I go back. Your ninja character Very sheet simple. doesn't have climbing walls. No, no my it does. Ninja... She's talking about Jenica. 
She does I, have I'm with you. You're, all, you're all set now. Okay. I'm, I'm on the same wavelength. The, the points will take care of it. I am too now. Thanks. I beat disguise by one. Yeah. And then I'm going to climb. One with the penalty? No. Not with the penalty. So you start to climb. Did you so I start to climb. What about your Patreon? Patreon. I already used it. You already used it. Uh, so what, is, what, what, wait, wait, wait. What? You've got a... Don't you have a um, divine relationship? Oh, I do. I'm divine relationship. Oh, you could Ooh. re-roll, yeah. Ooh, okay. Re-roll. Do you want me to use the one that I used for climbing for disguise? The one you just failed. That's just the re- one you need to do. Re-roll it. Re-roll. Okay, I uh, beat that one. I got that one right on with the penalty. With the penalty. Yes, and the other one okay. I beat with the penalty by two. Okay. So I'm disguised so it's not the and greatest, climbing. It's not the greatest black bear. It was uh, very or quick. the greatest gorilla impression ever. Black bears might actually fall for it. I'm not sure. Maybe because you're wearing a black Super bear. Super authentic black bear. Yeah. Um, but so you Closest start thing we have. climbing your way up and through. And uh, yeah, you managed ooh, to ooh, ooh. you managed to get to the ooh, um, ooh. the second floor ooh. Uh, unaccosted. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh. Thank you for your ooing. Um, I'm blending. <laughs> yes, you are blending. Jebediah, you're up next. So when he grabbed the uh, pole, did I grab his railgun? Absolutely. Right. <laughs> I wasn't sure what had just happened. Any uh, well, you know, never mind. Um, so I'm just uh, watching them stand on hold. Okay. Till any gorillas uh, move far, on. All you've seen from the gorillas are the ones that are coming flying. flying out the windows from uh, the crash. All right. If only it was like the golden eye. Well, so so can I see the one. big one up on top? Uh, no. Not currently. Mm. All Not right. from the ground, at least. Next. Hmm. If you were up higher in an adjacent building or something, then you could start. You know, looking across and such. But from where you are, that angle, no. All right, then uh, I suppose for my action, I'll just run up to an adjacent building, sprint up the sp- stairs. Okay, that sounds good. And yeah, as you start getting up there and you're running up the stairwell, and for some reason the stairwell happens to be oriented perfectly so that you can look out the side windows and look across the doorway and, or the roadway, and you do see uh, every once in a while other gorillas. Then there. I'll just set up shop right there. Sounds good. For the next round. Cool. Uh, Teddy. Um, you are going to challenge the King Gorilla to a rap battle, I believe. I believe that is what is going to happen. <laughs> After you, sir. I don't roll for this? Okay. Well, I mean, I... Does he see the King Gorilla? Yeah, yes, yeah, he Yeah, I mean, I can't just... Uh, I mean, he basically just has to call him out, right? Yeah, you yell out and you... You King Gorilla! So give me your call out. <clears throat> how do you, how do you do this? Hadn't written one Don't forget, don't forget Franklin's got to be his hype man. Franklin, give me a beat. <clears throat> Now stop. King Gorilla, I challenge you to a rap battle. Show yourself, the man. Or man-ape. And there is a pause, and the King Gorilla does uh, poke oh, 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 oh. its head over the, the roof and look down. <sighs> T to the E to the double D-Y. If you land in Teddy's rifle sights, you're likely going to die. Be ye beast, be ye man. When you hit that earth so wormy, that is not where you'll be buried, for I practice taxidermy. I will stuff you, I will mount you, you'll be reborn from my womb to then proclaim my godly greatness in my trophy hunting room, for I'm the king. Oh yes, how'd I land this royal gig? It's because I walk really softly and the stick that I carry is motherfucking big! Yo, yo. Bully. Yo. Can you something drop? Uh, King Gorilla looks over the side, looks down at you. <laughs> then he goes back. Frank looks all like, I think you took that round, sir. <laughs> um, that was incredible. Yeah, that was really, it was really good. Good night. Uh, Annie, you're up. Good well, for, she is currently oh, just like Chatting. in shock. Yeah, I'm sure they do. At Teddy. Very excited. Okay. Uh, well, you um, go hunting. I, I, I run, which I so assume... So, Annie, I need from you a, um... Let's see, what would be an appropriate thing to ask? Um, let's go with soul. We're going to use that as luck. I need you to beat your soul check. Do you need to beat my soul? You need to roll against your soul, please. You could roll that one. You're right in the middle. I, I, I know, I know, I know. I'm thinking, Annie, 
Annie Oakley doesn't get to say, hey, I'm Annie Oakley, can I take your bananas? You need to find out if they have any. To turn off mine. Also, you're carrying a gun. Right. Yeah. <laughs> One thing you can do with a gun is rob people. <laughs> <laughs> so you gotta head to the grocery store, what you gonna do? Yes, I'm gonna go okay. to the grocery store. And you want me to roll something. You want me to roll my soul? Yeah, you need to beat your soul roll. What? All right, yeah, I'm taking roll. a meta point. I'm, Take two. No, I'm going here. Okay. No, crap. No, I'm going here. I still won, don't worry. Cause then, oh, oh, screw it. You've got a bunch of meta points right now. I know, I took one more. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I missed it by one. Patriot? She With, I've missed already it used earlier it. on her trick shot. Oh, right. I missed it by one. So you run into the general store, <laughs> and there's a bit of a line. <laughs> yeah, she's like. And it's I'm all rosy, so, you, so I, I wait in line. You do for a moment, yeah. um, but then everyone can tell that you seem a little bit hectic. <laughs> and the uh, the guy running the counter looks over at you and says. Uh, M miss, um, can, can I help you? I need your bananas. <laughs> <laughs> the poor shopkeepers in this world. <laughs> um, I lost my pants. I'm, I need your banana. <laughs> uh, yes. Um, I'm making a hat. <laughs> we have no bananas. <laughs> Ask for plantains. Yes. yes. You have no bananas. Well, I we have know. no bananas today. <laughs> I knew that one. Oh, okay, hold on. <laughs> and he goes back to the first person in line and starts helping them out. Um. And that was a gorilla's turn. <laughs> I gotta take this. I just get to see. <laughs> You're just gonna wait in line. <laughs> My dear, dear friend Mags, I have been waiting 20 minutes to make that joke. <laughs> Wasn't really worth it, but it was still fun. <laughs> Made her cry a little bit. Oh, I was laughing so hard. I started. You made dads around the world proud. All oh, no. praise OD. All oh, praise OD for his dad jokes. Take. All of the other ones, not so much. That one I will take. All oh. praise OD, whose ass is so um, flat you could grow corn. So on it. the it's only, not, yeah, uh, the only nice one of you who has any gorillas around right now is you, Crash. Okay. And you, you're good. you're about midway up to this building or so. Okay, and, I got um, And now melt down. Okay. And, this. and so actually, yeah, we do need to drop a melt. Oh, but, thank God, first, I'm taking this one. First, Where are they going? First, I'm going to do the gorillas attacking you because they need to do their round first. So, okay. Um, so there are. I can't wait to find out what that was about. Uh, a couple of gorillas are going to charge you, Crash. The last thing. Yeah, that'd be crazy not to. <laughs> and they're going to run towards you. <laughs> and I will need. I will only need two defensive checks. Oh man, that seems like a lot. Um, I well, they each had two attacks, and I rolled an 18 and an 18. Yeah, that, no, that's, that's really awesome. Yeah. Uh, right. But I, I did win, and zigging and zagging was a big part of my critical hit this turn. Take a three point bonus. Okay, I totally bullshat you out of that three point bonus, but I will take it. <laughs> and remember it when you're the GM. Oh, okay. Yeah. You, you think I'm not going to cut you any breaks, buddy? <laughs> I'll cut you all the breaks. You'll have broken arms, broken legs. Breaks the days. I uh, made the first one. Sweet. Second one is dicier. <laughs> dicier. And dads are happy again. Three. Shit. I'm rolling like you now. Nicely done. Yeah. Uh, in fact, the, the second gorilla that charged at you, um, and with that roll and with its rolls, um, that gorilla, as it came running towards you, you definitely dodged out of the way and it went straight out the window. Nice. That's an excellent dodge. Mm -hmm. Splat. So one more gorilla is missed. I can't praise Odie for that. Oh. It does count as a dad joke. I'm converting. Praise the dad. <laughs> you can't. It was for the whole session. You said you loved me. That sounded wrong. Okay, uh, that was the gorillas. First up is Crash. Oh, Jesus. Are we, what? Um, oh, Meltdown. But we're melting down. Yeah, let's do that Meltdown. Oh. I think we had one Meltdown today so far. So. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, so, who's got, you got I got him. Who do you got first? Uh, right now, I got Richard Gatling. That's going to go to our good friend, Jebediah. I know him. What do you got next? Oh, I got the, the lovely Miss Emily Dickinson. That is going to go to you. Me? Yep. Oh. Uh, Johnny Appleseed. That's going to go to uh, Rosie. 
Hey, Sarah, trade you. Oh. Teddy Roosevelt. Teddy is going to go, yep, to uh, over to Jenica. And you get, which leaves you with the <coughs> Annie, Annie is going to be played by Nick. All right. Good Lord, my stats are crap. Oh, no. <laughs> Here, here's the thing. Jo Johnny you took that off about uh, like an hour ago. You? I don't have anything. I'm that not. Your glasses. No way I to saw be that seen. But it's just, I mean, that's for Jenica. That. It's just that. for the. It's for you the. Can the okay. You can. Uh, you can wear this. You can do the yeah, hair. Deal. And then we're, the we're staying where we are on our. I don't have a slider. I don't have a. Uh, I don't have a shock. That's what I shot to drop on you. Okay. Don't get me wrong. If I had them, I would throw them at you incessantly, but I don't have them. I'm stuck. I'm stuck in the bear. Yeah, Annie's Annie Annie thing is that her time. stats are crap. She's got <clears throat> four body, four yeah, mind, my four gun? soul. Great. She's amazing with the shot, and she's convinced that she's great at everything else. So, which actually earned you some more character building points because of your delusion. I know. So, first up is going to be uh, Gatling, Richard Gatling. <laughs> really? Yeah. Well, shit. You're telling me I'm two stories up, and yep. I'm now in a hallway. Yep. How many, how many gorillas are uh, There's one gorilla on you currently, and uh, there are others that are aware that you're working your way up the building. And I'm, I'm <laughs> Jebediah. <laughs> yeah, you're all Jebediah. We have meta points. Yes. All right. Here's what's going to happen. This is all I'm going to do on this round right here. I'm going to look that gorilla right in his face, and I'm going to go, like this, and I'm going to use it as a feint. I'm using my brain. I'm going to get him thinking up here, and then I'm going to kick him square in. That's two weeks in a row you've gone there. Kelly really likes it. That's a gorilla. It. Okay, give me the shot. That's a gorilla. No pun intended. Not. So I got to do a mind shot, mind roll first to fool him, or just you want me to? Uh, yeah, give me a mind, mind check first. Um, I beat it by one. Awesome. Give yourself a two-point bonus to your attack roll. I beat it by five. I did not make the defensive check. So, yes, you do catch that gorilla square in the happy sack. <laughs> Sounds like that. Wow. Good enough for me. And uh, you're using Gatling right now, right? Yep. Or actually, you're... Are you attacking I, I, Well, I'm me, but I'm in Gatling's body, so it means that his unarmed is a seven. seven. I appreciate I your... I will generously give you ten points of damage on that. I appreciate your bodily sacrifice for the cause of greatness. We must rescue the damsel immediately. Onward. Bully. Tally-ho. <laughs> Mad libs of Matt right there. <laughs> it's like... Uh, next up is Emily. Ah! Well, as you can see, I've put on a bear suit and I've stealthily climbed up the side of the building, pretending to be a gorilla, making <laughs> really good gorilla sounds the whole way What would those sound like again? If I remember correctly, they were like, Ooh! 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 Like that. Sounds good. But, uh, realizing that this plan is dumb, I look in the window to see if there's any, like, gorillas killing my friends. Uh, and when I see that there are... Yeah, you're on the same floor as, as Gatling, yeah. Uh, I continue Crash's work. So you... Uh, I'm going to use, I'm going to use a, uh, one of... One meta point. Okay. And I'm going to, uh, I see these, th these throwing knives are really cool, so... Yes. I'm gonna wing a throwing knife uh, into the buttocks of a gorilla that is near enough to hit at with a ranged attack. There is a gorilla that is currently attacking Gatling. Oh, perfect! Could, That's the one specifically that I would like to attack. Yeah, you could. I think you have two attacks if you use the same attack style. Okay, then I will use 
two attacks. You could Good. also move back to where you it. were, and I would use a mega me, uh, min max so that you can still. It's a lovely idea, actually. I like that. If idea. That's a so I'll burn my min max so he gets yep. the d8s on either side. And uh, that is beautiful. And there are how many gorillas in this room? Just the one right now. Just the one gorilla. Yep. Okay. So two attacks at Mr. Gorilla. I can't yep. even see you. I'm like, hang on here. Always. Thank you. So five and her avatar AC with that is four, 15. No, 10. Uh, her throwing, her throwing star, star is only a 10. That's no, at a 14. Oh, okay. Yes, I see it now. 14. Uh, I, yeah, I, yeah, I rolled a five. Yeah. So uh, you rolled a five? Yeah. Oh, so you beat by a lot. Yeah, okay. Um, and your second throw? I beat by a lot again. I rolled six that time. Sweet. Okay, so that's... Also, because I am Emily Dickinson currently... Um, Do you can pass? I use cultural arts? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I couldn't help it. Only... Only... Yes! <laughs> I deserved the claw right there. You can use it to discuss the um, various advantages and disadvantages to the styles of boat <laughs> that are currently being used by the San Franciscan Navy. All right. Whose All turn right. is it? I know what I'm doing uh, next So turn. next up is going to be Johnny. And actually, with those two and then the unarmed that he had done earlier, that is actually enough to incapacitate this gorilla. Oh, we did good with the throwing stars. Yeah. <laughs> so Ninja Emily is, Dickinson rocks. Now it's Johnny? Yes. Yeah, Johnny's up next. All right. Uh, Rosie, upon finding herself in the body of Johnny Appleseed, uh -huh. old man, remembers... The last time this happened, <laughs> Jebediah took over the body of Annie Oakley and made her shoot herself in the foot. Yes, this did happen. Ooh. Rosie looks across, sees King Gorilla, right? Because he was set up. Yes. Excellent. Rosie, I mean, Johnny Appleseed, old geriatric <laughs> Johnny Appleseed, is going un un unsure of what the gorilla prefers is going to take off his pants. Then he's going to take his shirt and do that 90s girl where you like slip mm -hmm. it through, oh, yeah. right? Uh -huh. And then take two apples, that was hot, right? Oh. Take two apples and put one in each thing so it's, he's got apple boobs. Yeah. Okay. We've and then there. Johnny Appleseed Pineapple, apple boobs. is going to seduce the gorilla <laughs> from across the building. From across the building with the no pants and the sexy 90 apple boobs. I'll allow it. <laughs> That I knew he would. That gorilla is just going to get jealous. Give, give yourself a four-point bonus. She has some. I, I mean, if you, I was going to use my buff if you weren't going to give. Yourself give yourself a four-point nope, bonus. No, Bugs Bunny dressing up like Girl Bunny is always funny. Do it. Hey, don't kink shave that gorilla. She okay. happened to find what he's into. Uh, so I get a four-point bonus? Yep. Excellent. I'm also going to use my rosy buff, so technically I have a nine-point bonus. Oh, Lord. You have to roll a 20. <laughs> She's using a rosy buff over there. <laughs> she beat it by... 16. Yes. So, yes. So you do. You set down the rifle. You set up Johnny in the most attractively seductive pose no. you can think of. I would really like to hear you say whatever come online you're going to use. And I hope to I God it has a lot of that. S's. I can't do a list very well. You That's why write, I was hoping Chris would say. No, no, you can write, write it down for me and I'd say it. No. Just, just go to whenever you're going to go. A to lot the, of S. Oh, crap. Um, at the... The thick of tongue, right? Sir! <laughs> oh, sir! My shirt seems to be small. And I'm about to just fall out of it. And just that's when the apples go <laughs> flying, right? Right, but then the apples get replaced real. Like, there's, there's a turnaround and like a butt shot, and then like the apples go back in, so you turn back around and the apples are still there. <laughs> I don't think you like bananas. <laughs> <laughs> I think you like apples. And I just gotta say, I have an endless supply. Jonathan, I am disturbed by this turn of events. I like to eat, eat, oh God. eat apples and bananas. <laughs> am I done? I'm gonna have that song. Am I done? Oh, yeah. I mean, yeah. yeah. Um, but no, I mean, if I... There, there is no defense for that. The, the, the king gorilla is just... Just really, 
really interested in what you've got going on yeah, there. And I'm on, I'm 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 beckoning and, him to uh, come to this building. And he, oh, 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 oh. he you know the, the woman that he had, he's like, oh, 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 oh. Uh, right off the side of the building. Doesn't throw her off the building. Hey, hey get back over here, apple bosom. And, uh, you know, throws her off to the, yeah. the to his side. And and yeah, he, he actually he goes over to the side, he climbs, he starts climbing down the side of the building. So he's climbing down the side uh, of the building, yeah. and there are apples now on the ground from her bosom, his bosom. Uh, yes. yes, two fell out in one of the shimmies. Great. Correct. It's my turn, yes? It is Teddy's turn. Is Fantastic. Next. I'm taking an apple, and since I have sports football, I'm going yes. to hurl an apple at the King, King Kong, Donkey Kong, dun, dun. man gorilla thing and peg him right Somebody in the head. Out. That's really not how you play football. Do it. Give me the roll, yeah. You're going to try to knock that out? Football, Give me you the got roll. this. Hold on. <laughs> Use your claws. I can't. I can't. <laughs> I beat that by six. Yes. Sweet. Uh, he's... With a spiral. It's a spiraling apple. Mail that defensive check, too. Um, so you do. You wing that apple up and uh, you manage to smack him right upside the head. This is how we play sports this in college. This actually distracts the king of the gorillas. Yes. He loses his balance. He slips and he comes crashing down to the ground. Excellent. And then, and then Annie, you are up next. And he is he is unconscious from the fall. All oh, right. Victory well, for King Teddy. Did I see what Mr. Johnny Appleseed did? Yes. I'm going to mistakenly think that that is our new tactic. And I will then take off my pants, <laughs> put the apples in my shirt, go back to the shopkeeper and ask, now can I have some bananas? <laughs> <laughs> also, we broke this, QQ, chat. We does this hat make me look like Humpty Dumpty wearing a teacup? <laughs> Um, we still have no bananas. <laughs> actually, sure? actually, since you asked that question, it would be yes. <laughs> we have no bananas. We have, we have no bananas today. Are you sure? <laughs> I've, got, I've got some plantains, but they're not ripe. <laughs> <laughs> he does. He he will go and he will find you the nearest whatever the nearest to a banana shape. Fruit or vegetable he can One find. One of those little runts, the candy out of the thingy. Uh, just, as, the little, well, this is pre, John, unfortunately. Is terrible. Um, you know There's what? No he's, in he LA is in so either. disturbed by this <laughs> that he takes a zucchini, a can of yellow paint, dips it in, <laughs> hands it to you, and says, "Just please go." Now was that so hard? <laughs> <laughs> it is just now yellow paint. Shit. <laughs> Hopefully it's quick drying paint. So no, she's got it's not. It's two paint apples street. and a long yellow zucchini. <laughs> two apples that I didn't pay for. Yes. Yes. Taking out the front of her shirt now. Yes. And Annie it, Oakley, American <laughs> legend. It wasn't hard. And at the end of that, you go back to your regular identities. Uh, do you mind taking this back? No. Oh, Lord. Thank you. <clears throat> Uh, with the defeat of the King Gorilla, that is somehow enough to um, convince the other gorillas to stand down. They uh, they aren't fully organized in a in a militia type arrangement, but they do have a sense of hierarchy, and they've recognized that there is a new alpha at play. And King Teddy. Uh, and yeah, I mean, actually, it would be Teddy after knocking down, down? Yeah. King Gorilla. So Teddy, you are now king of the gorillas as well. He committed suicide rather than face me in a rap battle. <laughs> That is the conclusion we shall take. <laughs> no, it survived. Franklin? Survived the fall. Oh, yes. Tried. I think that's actually the suicide. most normal meta met meltdown we've ever had. That's true. Why do um, I have a banana between my breasts? <laughs> we seem to be apples. <laughs> you know, I wasn't going to say anything, but Miss Ogley is looking very nice to me. <laughs> So, uh, you, uh, say, madam, is four. that a zucchini painted yellow in your bosom, or? So you managed to. Um, <laughs> oh, I'm Lord. just happy to see you in standing too close. <laughs> so you've managed to. Uh, Can I start using the Clancy the bear to wipe off yes, the gorilla? Yes. yes. <laughs> so you you are able to. Uh, you were thanked by the bear zookeepers down. for bear your down. work mm -hmm. on helping to contain the gorillas, <laughs> and uh, you were able to return back to Maria. It's okay. 
who uh, who will set you up the next morning. You'll hop on the train to head out to the dam I'm done. to I deal that was Miss Patty. with the um, to deal <laughs> with sad bear drinking. In the <laughs> sad bear drinking <laughs> to deal with the dam situation. Awesome. So we're back on the yeah. train. We're gonna go to oh, now. You, we're you all are, the way to the, the dam. It's the next morning, and Maria bids you farewell, and you are able to. Uh, to sneak, well not sneak, but you're up on this, you're on this train, um, in theory, in a stealthy way. We'll find out <laughs> next week. We're on the stealth train we'll to the dam. We'll find out next week just how <laughs> stealthy stealth you are. On the stealth train to the dam. stealth train, yeah. Oh, wow. Stealth um, train. That was, that was stealth train. Chat. That was just uh, too damn much fun. Yeah, that was awesome. The don- I didn't even think about the crash thing with Donkey Kong when that came up. Like, holy cow. Um, but yeah, so that's where, that's where things end up. He is, did. That's where things end off is that you guys find yourself um, back on the train, back on the train, on the train heading east to Phoenix, to, Phoenix okay, to deal with the dam. Um, I know there's at least one more waffle, waffle to hand out. I know there's some other announcements folks wanted to make. Just so, just so we're clear, we started the campaign closer to the dam than we ended it. No, no, no. We were in Northern California. We went down to Southern California. Now we're going across. We were to in Phoenix. Nevada, weren't we? You, we were in Nevada, you, you, and, you, and we haven't even gotten to Phoenix. But yet. you didn't have to cross a desert on foot. Okay, there's this. There's this. It's it was more, the biggest problem. Is you had no resources to really make that that crossing. And um, we had Clancy. <laughs> I think wearing a black bear suit across a desert might be genius. Um, so Christian, if you want to drop hardy. that waffle, and then I know Emily has some stuff. Is Emily out there? Cool. Do you want to do announcements first? Because I got yeah, to get some He's got to get his guitar and stuff. Do you want to announce first? Or do you want. Announce. He's got to get some guitar. Me. So. I, just, I just need a minute or two. Um, I think it might be better to do the waffle first. Yeah. I think so. With everything, okay. yeah. I just said he needed a minute. Yeah. What? I know, but I'm not going to get it. I know. So. <laughs> I'm trying to help you. I, I know I'm you sorry. Okay. Thank you so much. <laughs> so um, I will helpful. just vamp then for a moment. Um, okay. So. You can all vamp. Thank you, everyone, who's been watching and such. Uh, if you haven't been checking it out, um, please uh, go ahead and pay attention to what's going on on patreon.com uh, slash zombie Orpheus. Check out Hyper's uh, account as well. I know that they have a Patreon going on. Um, thank you to everyone who's been supporting us on that and keeping things going. Um, we've been very, very blessed with the support on the show and very thankful for that. Oh, and that includes the crazy ass things that you guys do, <coughs> like throwing Donkey Kong at us in the middle of Oh, you of did LA. that? Oh, yeah, that, that yeah. was them. Good job. Chief. And also the, the praising <laughs> you, you, of Odie. Did you think Chris had a Donkey Kong? And, like, yeah, I was not going to throw Donkey Kong at you randomly. You you were going to reach the dam originally, and then some, oh, other, some, other, earn some other things Kong. happened. We got waylaid. The, yeah. it, I mean, the dam was with the gorillas, just things didn't. Uh, this, this made more. I like it. I don't it. want to say this made more sense. <laughs> <laughs> on, the, <laughs> on the bright side, though. That's such a relative way to do it. you want to say it made more sense. It would have been much harder to fight Donkey Kong on top of that dam in the city. Yeah. Yeah. Did we rescue the blonde, by the way? You did. And it, yes. And she went back to her homely ways. What's wrong with her face? (laughs) I put some of the gorilla makeup that I had on me on her just to help her out. Actually, it, it turned out that she wasn't a real person. <coughs> she was just a, a carving. Car- that, background deco. Yeah. yeah, that they had picked up somewhere, and people from the streets thought she was real. Then I uh, paint a smiley face on her. Yeah. Just for fun. Um, let's see. Also, uh, yes, yeah, so, uh, you know we're here every week. Journey quest stuff's being sent out soon. Woo, woo. Matt, when's your next He's book? ready. Uh, I'm writing it now. I mean, not right now, but I'm in the process. That should be out in the summer, fall. Sweet. Will it have any rap battles in it? Uh, God, I hope not. <laughs> <laughs> that was an epic one you dropped tonight. By yeah, the way. that was very good. Very good. Was yeah. Thank you for letting me. R- I'm awesome. glad I had my notebook. Yes. All right. Yeah. Notebooks are important. But they are. I, and the pen. I look forward to sitting at a table having time to write stuff. Sometimes when other people are, yeah, that'll be fun. I've decided that this is my waffle notebook. This is where I just kind of keep them all. Mm-hmm. Because oh. I never look at them again, and uh, now I can someday. Now you can. That makes because sense. somebody said that might be a good idea. Yeah. It is. It's all right. Nice. So uh, this uh, this waffle was um, uh, Magic the Gathering. Uh huh. That's right. This is my very. That's what it was. And uh, I noticed that I've done a couple of Star Wars ones already. And mm-hmm. Magic, I know, is also very popular. The kids are into it. Um, in you I know. believe in magic. magic. Right. Uh, so yes, I believe it's my instead name. of uh, you know just writing about the whole game, I wanted you know I needed it to be short and sweet because I had two waffles to get out and uh, I procrastinated. No. So, uh, yeah, this is a short and sweet song about a short and sweet deck ah, mm-hmm. of cards. No Others used to play Magic the Gathering, just in case anyone thought I said dick just then. I did not. It was deck. I heard the second deck. time you said <clears throat> Never mind. <laughs> 
I heard deck. So, rock. Rock. You challenge me, sir? My honor is besmirched. But soon, you will be scorched. If you think you can step to me, you are mistaken. Your path to hell is the shortest trip you've ever taken. You'll get four tunes, it's the only promise that I'm making. Cause I'll turn five, I'll be frying you like pepper bacon. Legacy burn! Legacy burn! Game will be over in just five turns. Like a good bird. Like, like a good stuff. legacy bird deck. And then you end yeah. it with picking up, what is it, Black Lotus, ripping it in half and walking away? No, 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 it's all red, buddy. Oh. It's all red, no monsters. Uh, that's okay. Chaos Orb. And that's Chaos Orb. Oh, I'm yeah. so sorry. I literally it's never played the game. It's the greatest move ever. I didn't the hand of God used to use that way, too. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, I see. Oh, I'm over there. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, Chris. Yeah. Hey, everybody. Hi. I'm Emily. If you Hi. don't know me... I'm the community manager of Hyper RPG. You manage us so well. I do, thank you. I know, I just gave myself a compliment, but I, I gave it to you. It. You just agreed. We yeah. all feel managed communally. Thank mm -hmm. you. Thank and you. well. Okay, so two announcements. The first is that next week after Masters of the Metaverse, HeroClix is coming back for a limited run. So I just want to let you guys know that. We're, I think it's eight weeks. Uh, we're going to have some. Uh, like four weeks of the DC packet and four weeks of the Marvel packet, and uh, this is going to be sponsored by WizKids, so that is really awesome. Whoa. Um, the second <laughs> is that um, after some great times and some awesome uh, kill myself on these cords, awesome stuff. <laughs> QQ is deciding to move on. Yep. So uh, she, her last day is going to be Thursday. <gasps> So we just wanted to take a minute and let you guys know. It's tell them about where you're going. It's exciting. It, it is exciting. It's weird. I'm nervous and oh my gosh. Um, I am transitioning over to work on the university side at the University of Washington as a media supervisor. Mm -hmm. So that's awesome. So totally like in my wheelhouse, but totally out of my wheelhouse. It's like 50-50 and I have no clue what I'm doing for the most part that's other great. than I'm working with what I know. That's yeah. awesome. Yay! Yeah. Q -Q. So just going on a new adventure. But you're still going to come and visit us all yeah, the time, right? Of course. Yeah. Uh-huh. If it of helps, okay. you're going to keep also, we, we have was... no idea what we're doing every week yeah. over here. Yeah. I, I know <laughs> where you guys are on Mondays. <laughs> exactly. Uh, I was a thumper before I was an employee in crew, and I will still continue to be a thumper afterwards. So Q -Q, I'll be around you. I just want, want to say thank you for all your sound wizardry. Aww. Your ability to time sounds. At the perfect moment, have lead to many wonderful times in various RPGs. Yeah. Good luck with what you do next. Oh, yeah! Thank you, Q -Q. You're, You're leading to many wonderful you, times. You take the seat of honor. So All right, now's the time if you're going to send QQ a nice message to send QQ a nice message. Yeah. Or but also on Twitter. Or on Twitter, yeah. you know, you et cetera, to... et cetera. Yeah. But she's here till Thursday uh, doing some... Oh, oh. 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 Yeah. QQ. You're going to take her out after. Yes, it's true. Uh, I'll be around. To, be to around. a meal, not yeah. take not, her. Not no, take, her, take out. her out. If only we would have started this a few minutes ago. She could have run the last round. Huh? Oh, we would have yeah. been so much nicer to her. <laughs> oh, but also I should announce who's taking over, and oh, it's right. Mark. Who yeah. 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 Mark. Yeah. Mark, Mark is a good uh, good example egg. of making his way up the chain. It's mm -hmm. true. Did you just play yourself as an airborne? He did. Yeah. <laughs> he, he earned that for the ride to the emergency room in like yeah. week three. So. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. God. He's already he's already got Mark, that. Mark, come here for just a hot second. Just a hot oh, one. Oh, that's though. right. That's a hot second. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's a hot second. Mark. Welcome. Yay! 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 You're welcome. Uh, <laughs> they've been training. Yep. Mark's been actually I, running the board for the last week. Mark was actually running the whole entire show today. Yeah. Oh, really? I might have, like, pointed at things. Over <laughs> stepped a bit. Do you back to me to be on the that. shot? Were you managing his micros? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's. 
It's been very interesting not being able to do stuff. <laughs> That's like GMing the show. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like I have all this control. Yeah, really yeah. don't. <laughs> so anyway, we just wanted to take a minute, say thank you to QQ, welcome Mark aboard, and, uh, oh, Sarah? No, I was just, bye? I was saying welcome and <laughs> bye and welcome hearts. And bye. I, was being, you and, oh. I was trying to be energetic. Yes. And, and thumpers are amazing. That's and, what I was doing. Uh, I think we should call it a night. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah no, that's perfect. Let's call it a night. Thanks so much, Thanks, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. See you next week. Bye. Next week. Lesson three.